Yo chat, you guys ready for a new game? Another one? We're flying through these games like they're nothing. And also, Persona games like they're nothing. Hell yeah! Let's freaking go! I'm like half not ready though. <laughs> give, me, give me one second. Woo! Happy Friday though, everybody. I hope you guys are doing well this morning. Also, whoa, 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 do you, see, you guys see the top of my uh, screen? Does this mean I have 69 trophies? <sighs> Fuck, I don't want to get another trophy. How do you, like, not get more trophies? Is there a way? <laughs> <laughs> I just want to keep it like this forever. Pog, save it. I know, because we're probably about to get more trophies whenever we start Yakuza 3 here, right? All right. All right, time to screenshot it while I still can. All right, got the screenshot. That means it it it's real. Oh, wait, no, I got to get the screenshot with my name in it because then that means that it's legit because it's me. All right. There we go. Got the screenshot. <laughs> it's forever going to be there now because I'm probably going to ruin that trophy count now. Big rip. Oh. No! Did it just... <laughs> God damn it. 69. I know. My... My... My fucking controller. It connected to my PC instead of my PS4. I don't know how to make it not do that. <sighs> okay. <laughs> PS4, not PC. PS4. Son of a bitch. PS4! <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> I'm just gonna restart my PS4. I know, I do have to connect it with cable first, or I can just turn it on. I think I can also do it this way. I just unplugged my, uh... Why did it connect? I, I, this... <sighs> That's so strange. Okay, well, it looks like I gotta connect it. God damn it. This sucks. You have 203 trophies. I actually don't play a lot of PlayStation games. Hello, PS4? Turned you on. I don't play a lot. I only recently started playing PS4 games. I know, 69. Why? Why? Oh my god. I was gonna say, my PS4 is not even turning on anymore. I really broke it. Uh, although, I, I did turn on the wide BTTV emote, the wide Kiryu emotes. I, I did add those. Alright, there we go! I got this! Don't worry! <laughs> We're working! Although, wait, do I have to refresh because I don't see it? I literally just added it, like, five minutes ago, so I don't know if it's already connected or not. Oh, I don't see the wide yet. Boo. All right, anyway, so Yakuza 3. <laughs> wide Kiryu. Oh, there it is. Yes. Oh, now I see the wide Kiryu. Now I understand. Okay, this is uh, already like... Okay, well, new game. Let's go. Normal. Oh, that's why it's being weird. Oh, this is my PS4 controller. This is my PC controller. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's... Okay. It was right next to me. I picked up my PC one. God damn it. And now they're switched. I have one for PS4 and one for PC, so I don't get the Bluetooths crossed. Oh my god, is that Harga? 
Okay, whoa, what an opening cutscene. Hello. Kyo he just caught that fit. What the fuck? <laughs> Shit! <laughs> what did Kiryu become? Expert fisherman. I guess the other games have trained him for this. Aww. Kiryu's <laughs> like, I got this fish for you guys, and you ditched me for Uncle whoever Rik Rikia is. What about the fish I just caught? Whoa! Okay. Well, we started this game off great. Death! Yay! In front of all of the kids. It wouldn't be a Yakuza game if somebody didn't die at the beginning, middle, and end of the game. <laughs> レイの計画の件でと言えばわかると。同時もです。Oh, <laughs> だから断ると言ってるんだ。ヘロー、ヘロー。たとえ断っていいのでしょうか。どういう意味だ。お言葉ですが、今本家は直系白宝会の上がりでやっていけてる状態です。もしあの沖縄の一件、うちが引き受ければ、この先10年は食っていけるだけの金が本家に流れ込みます。
said that these graphics are bad. These are pretty good graphics. I was expecting a lot worse. This doesn't seem that bad. Like, yeah, it's older, but this is actually... I'm, I'm impressed, actually. I was expecting way worse. What? どこからどう見ても、ご本人としか言いようがありません。どこに今、会長室にお通ししております。わかった。Okay, Daigo, holy shit. Okay, okay. Uh, I don't want to start Look, I don't want to start simping for Daigo or anything, but it's escalating very quickly. What? <laughs> no, he's not here. No, this is no, 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 no,沖縄の土地の権利書。だが、あの土地には四代目が。知ってますよ。あなたにはあの気流かさ。What だが、だが俺はあの沖縄の一件もう手を引くと決めたんだ。あなたは東条会の六代目、三万人の構成員を養うにはそんなことは言ってらんないでしょう。それでも、Someone's wearing それは困りましたね。Okay, this is like a dream. What ha what's happening? This isn't real. This isn't real life. What the fuck? Ojiki. Nagara. Ima shizutsu shitemasu. Torada. おやじの容態はくそ。さきちゃん、怖かったね。I am so lost. Either that or, like, this isn't real. This isn't real! お座れたんで。親父は腹に数発食らったみたいで。どこかの組の会社か。いえ。多分土地買収の絡みです。事務所から例の土地の権利書がなくなってました。何絶対玉城組の連中に決まってる。奴ら一年前のことで。俺たち
Okay, you can go back to the game now. New beginnings. Beginnings? What new beginnings? Somebody just got shot and my dead dad is non-dead. What? But uh, totally dead. It's not him. This is like... Uh, whatever. Uh. So. Wow, she looks a lot different? We can get to that later. I assume you'd like to pay your respects to the people you've lost first. Might be nice to stop for a second and reflect on everything that's happened. Oh god, story re- oh god, oh shit. Oh my god, look at me. Oh god, this is a- uh... okay. Oh Jesus, oh Jesus. <laughs> oh no! Oh god! Look at me! Wait! <laughs> Wait, I really am wide! <laughs> Why care you bug? I am I am wide. <laughs> Cal Cal, thank you for the four months. I appreciate it. Yo, I think it makes me look um I think it adds to the manliness. Also, what is the camera doing? Holy shit. Alright, we're gonna have to get used to this. How many sub stories are there? doesn't tell you like the other games. Oh shit. No spoilers. Sorry. Okay, upgrades. How does this work? Experience points. Okay. Well, whatever. Um Hi Kaoru. Did we bang yet? I thought you'd want to spend more time paying your respects to the people you've lost. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. That's just the same conversation. Okay, I thought she was gonna have special dialogue. Tarada, you are one of the leaders of the Kansai Yakuza conglomerate known as the Omi, Omi Alliance. Despite working for our rivals, you owed Kazuma-san a huge debt leading you to try and stop the Tojo clans in fighting over the missing 10 billion yen. After seeing the kindness and generosity in your heart, I decided to leave the Tojo clan in your hands. To protect the weakened Tojo from the Omi Alliance, you opted to call a truce with their leader, Jin Goda. But it was all part of a plot to take revenge for the Jingyuan massacre from over 20 years earlier. Even so, you owed your life to Cosmosan. That's why I chose to believe that you believe you when you asked me to trust you as you died. Because of you, Tarada, I learned never to give up on people, even when things take a turn from the worst. Aw, that's cute. So imagine if you if this was like your first Yakuza game. I don't know why you would start with Yakuza three of all games to start with, but like. If you started here, and you read that, you would be the absolute fucked up person ever. Like, you would not comprehend jack shit. You would read that and be like the Jingwion, uh, Omi Alai, Jing, what? <laughs> I hope someday the Tojo Clan becomes the kind of organization you always wanted it to be. Until that day, watch over them, please. Aww. Nishiki, oh! As long as I can remember, you were my friend and my brother. We were both taken in by Kazuma-san at Sunflower Orphanage, then joined a Yakuza organization called the Dojima Family, led by Patriarch Sohei Dojima. But when Yumi got kidnapped, you murdered Dojima and threw all of our lives into turmoil. I decided to leave Yumi with you and spend ten years in jail after taking the fall for the murder you committed. I sacrificed the world for you, yet Yumi's disappearance and your sister's illness led you down a path of despair. When I saw you again, ten years later, you were a changed man. All you cared about was becoming chairman of the Tojo clan. In the end, you and I fought over the ten billion yen that had been stolen from the Tojo. Even still, you sacrificed your sa yourself to save me. I wouldn't be standing here now if it wasn't for you. You were a great friend right until the very end. <laughs> Uh. Oh. 
I know these grades are like a recap, but it's also a nice way to get in Kiryu's brain, like how how he really sees all this stuff, his words on everything, because we don't really get that. Cosmosan, how can I repay you for everything you did for me? Even though you are a ranking Tojo officer, you devoted your life to Sunflower Orphanage and raised me and the other kids like we were your own flesh and blood. And when I got expelled from the clan and sentenced to 10 years in jail for the murder of Sohei Dojima, you were one of the only people who didn't abandon me. Then, when I finally got out of prison and you you used the Kazuma family to protect me from all the Tojo men who were out, of, out for my head. You even laid down your life to save Haruka. After your death, I took over as fourth chairman of the Tojo clan and managed to put a stop to the infighting. But I wanted to wash my hands of the Yakuza life, so I installed Tarada as the fifth chairman. Like me, he owed you a massive debt. That wasn't the end of my involvement, though. As I came back into the fold to deal with the Jingyuan ma Mafia's plot for revenge, you see, some Jingyuan members you spared 20 years ago wanted revenge on the Dojima family for their downfall, but I managed to thwart their plans. And now, the Tojo is at a crossroads yet again, but I have someone in mind to take over. Someone I trust to lead the clan back down the right path. You deserve- rest in peace, you deserve that much, and thank you for everything. Yumi! I still think back to the time me, you, and Nishiki spent at Sunflower. We had some fun, huh? Even after Nishiki and I joined up with the Dojima family, we never stopped spending time with you. Serena, the bar where you worked, ended up our favorite hangout spot. The three of us were happy then. Looking back on it now, it almost feels like a dream. Then, on that fateful day, Sohei Dojima kidnapped you, and you had to watch while Nishiki murdered him. The shock of it all caused you to lose your memory. Before you had regained it, though, you met a diet member named uh, Kyohei Jingu and conceived a child with him, Haruka. Once you recovered your memory and learned of Jingu's plan, you left Haruka at Sunflower and began working with Chairman Sarah and Kazuma-san to stop him. Yumi, there's so much I wish I had gotten the chance to say to you. I'm sure the same goes for Haruka, so we'll be back to visit again, I promise. Aww. It's nice to hear Kiryu's words on that. That's a lot of shit that happened! <laughs> In three games, I'm finished. Where's Reina and Shinji? Yeah, we don't get them. I guess you'll be leaving then, heading down to Okinawa tomorrow morning. You know, I never pegged you as the kind of guy to start an orphanage. I've been a dream- it's been a dream of mine to take care of kids though, just like Cosmosan did for me when I had nowhere to turn. A textbook Kazuma Kiryu response if I've ever heard one, but why Okinawa? There's a place there that would tie a sunflower. When their old manager died, they asked me if I knew anyone who might be able to lend a hand. And you decided that person should be you? It seemed like the perfect opportunity. Aren't many opportunities for an ex-Yakuza uh, out in the wild, anyway. I hear Okinawa's beautiful, too. Yeah, and the orphanage is right down by the beach. You should come visit when you get the chance. I love that, but I doubt I'll be able to able to for a while. I'm actually leaving the country tomorrow. What the fuck? Where to? The US. They're starting a training program for a new branch of the Metropolitan Police and they've asked me to be an instructor. Okay, well I guess we already lost our girlfriend, but did we have sex? <laughs> You're probably- you'd probably try to stop me if I said more, but it might be best to just leave it at that. <laughs> right, well, I can't say I'm not happy for you. I-, I it's good to see you following your heart. <laughs> I thought you'd say that, and besides, I don't think you'd like it very much if I turned them down to stay with you. Eh, guess not. There's still a lot I want to accomplish as a police officer, Kiryu-san. Career goals, you know? And I think America's the best place for me to do that. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably right. So let's go our separate ways for now. I'll come find you once I've done what uh, I've done what I need to. Okay. <laughs> what a joke! <laughs> Fun fact: the developers didn't know what to do with Sayama's character, so. Okay, but that's a fun fact. I absolutely did not want to know. Thank you. <laughs> that tells me way too much. Let's avoid the fun facts, please. まあ仕方ないでしょう。さやまくんには警察官としての夢がありますからね。夢ね。
At least we got Date at the end of the day. We got at least one boyfriend to hang out with. But oh wait, he's probably gonna die at the end of this game. あ、一家じゃタバコは吸えませんから。一家だと私は来月付けで4家から1家へ戻ります。極道相手の4家じゃ吸えても殺人事件を扱うエリートコースの一家じゃ吸えませんからね。昇進したのか。良かったじゃない
Oh, where is this coming from? Holy shit, I do not deserve that. Thank you so much for gifting another 10 subs, Alexander. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh. It really helps a lot, man. Thank you. Yuya! They deserve a farewell after all they've done for us. Time to pay those two a visit. Alright, time to go to Stardust. Oh, God. The good old Kamarocho. Oh god, it's so weird. Everything is so different. There's so many people. Holy shit. Oh, I just... He's an old man. I just... I just pushed that old man on the ground. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh. Know it all. Oh, his, okay, he's a know it all. Turns out the commotion a while ago was part of a struggle for control over a major Yakuza clan that started when its leader was assassinated. Yep. That ain't what I heard. I thought some Yakuza was from Osaka were trying to take over Kamurocho and it turned into a full scale yep. war. You're both wrong. They're trying to keep it under wraps, but it was actually a terrorist attack by an organized crime group from overseas. You serious? It's bigger than I thought. Oh my god. That's crazy. Um, old man, I'm really sorry for bumping into you earlier. Oh god, I feel so bad. And also, why do all the old men look like turtles? <sighs> all of the old men are hunched over and have a head, and it makes them look like a turtle. I now cannot find any old men. Oh my god, Yuya! Hi, Yuya! So, what's with the getup? Just getting my clean on. Those Go Ryu punks tore the place up real bad. Everyone's really been pinching in, though. So, they're doing all the hard work while you smoke? <laughs> what? You got it all wrong, Haruka chan. I was just taking a little breather. Eh, by the way, how are you feeling? <laughs> what, me? Better than ever, man. I'll, it'll take more than a few punches to put it dead in old Yuya. <laughs> it hurts to laugh. <laughs> if that's better than ever, I don't want to see what you, your, you hurt looks like. Oh, and how's Kazuki doing? Still over with the doc. Sounds like it's gonna still, it's still gonna be a while till he can come home, but he's doing good. Glad to hear it. By the way, Yuya, we're actually here to say goodbye. Mm. What do you mean, goodbye? I'm moving to Okinawa. I'm gonna be taking over an orphanage down there. And you're going too, Haruka-chan? <laughs> the place actually has pretty close ties to Sunflower, too. After what Haruka and I have been through, I think it'll be feel good uh, looking after some kids myself. Well, that's outright charitable of you, man. <sighs> but I gotta say, it's gonna be lonely around here without you. It's not like we're going to be that far. We still, We can still see each other, you know? You could even come visit us sometime. You know, that ain't such a bad idea. I'll ask Kazuki-san about taking the team down there for our next vacation. Sounds like a plan. Speaking of, I'm actually thinking to see Kazuki now. Anyway, Yuya, take care of this place while Ka Kazuki's out of commission, okay? I'll do what I can. Well, Kiryu-san, I guess this is it. Good luck down there. Oh, and you too, Haruka-chan. Bye, Uncle Yuya. Don't forget to come visit. I like how she calls him Uncle Yuya. Nah. Hey, you there! Is it true that Kazuki-kun, the owner of Stardust, was shot? I heard he's in the hospital. I can't even eat, I've been so worried. I must have lost at least 30 kilograms since I heard the news. So there's a rumor that Kazuki was shot. It's a rumor. Why hasn't he been to the club lately? You don't think he's been fired, do you? Not unless he fired himself. 
No, then what happened? I'm freaking out! Kazuki's uh, number one fan right oh, there. Oh. I found another turtle, but he doesn't have a hat on, so he looks a little bit less of a turtle. Oh, yeah. <gasps> Ice cream! Wait, can I go into the ice cream store? Oh my god, the camera. Oh god, this camera is very hard to get used to. I want ice cream! No point eating now, I'm not even hungry? You don't eat ice cream when you're hungry. You eat ice cream because you can! What the fuck? Where do we go? Oh. Oji -san? This is where Uncle Kazuki is, right? Yep, something up. <laughs> I was just thinking, can we go have some fun after we see him? Of course, Haruka. Just a sec there, buddy. <laughs> can I help you? This town's no place to be bringing a little girl, old man. You get lost on your way to the fun fair? This guy is cracking the fuck up. Oh my god, do you think you're that funny? None of your business. Now back off or I'll make you back off. <laughs> oh, I'm so scared. Dude, what's with this asshole? Guy's pissing me uh. off. Sure, pal, we'll back off if you hand over some cash. I mean, that girl of yours gets an allowance, yeah? How about Wash sharing the wealth? Sorry, not happening. Just fork it over, man. What is he doing? You don't want to get your ass beat in front of your kid, do you? You haven't listening, you old fuck. Look, if you get lost now, I'll forget this ever happened. But if you stick around, you're gonna pay. Promise. You think you can take us, asshole? You're the only one who's gonna be paying today, man. Either in cash or in blood. Your choice. I'll get you some blood if you want, but it's not gonna be mine if you catch me. All right, so now we get to fight. All right, how does fighting work in this game? We gonna find out. Peacock their mobs! <laughs> I'm gonna peacock your mom! Very rigid combat, but that's okay. It's just what we have to get used to. Objects that have a thing over them can be grabbed. Hello? Pick it up! Pick it up! Jesus Christ! You want some of the bike? Whee! are resilient, they really are. Well, that heat action was a lot, uh, less brutal.
Oh, oops. Why are you hunched over like a fucking turtle? Look at this guy. He looks like an actual turtle. Okay, that's it. Everybody in this game is a turtle. That's just it. All right, I'm calling everybody a turtle. I don't know why, man. Rewind time and redo. No! Why would I do that? <laughs> I'm sorry, man. We got it. We get. We'll get out of your hair. No harm, no foul. I don't remember saying you could leave. Please don't kick our asses anymore, old man. You really don't know how to talk to your elders, huh? Am I gonna have to beat some manners into you? Wait, no, no, we're beating anymore! Let her go! Maybe next time you'll remember your place. <laughs> of course, I'm going on the straight and narrow, promise! Get out of here. Thank God, sir! Alright, yeah, just leave. <laughs> Haruka is so used to this. Hey, Kazuki! Kiryu -san. Did you come all the way here just to see me? The doc says it'll still be a while until I can go home, but I'm on the mend at least. You're looking pretty healthy. Means a lot coming yeah. from you. Uncle Kazuki, we're actually here to say goodbye. Goodbye? Are you two going somewhere, Kiryu-san? The Goryu and Jingmyon have been dealt with, and Daigo's come around to being the next, ne next chairman. My job here is done. <laughs> We're moving to Okinawa! Okinawa, huh? That's pretty far. That's... kind of the point. Haruka and I are gonna be running an orphanage down there. Wow, I can't say we won't miss you, Kiryu-san, but I'm sure you'll be great! Yuya said pretty much the same thing. He also said you'd come visit. We've been looking for places to take the boys for some team building. Can't think of a better place than Okinawa! You better not forget! Don't worry, Haruka-chan. We'll visit soon. We'll return soon. Kiryu-san, thank you for everything. I owe you my life. Don't be ridiculous. If it wasn't for me, you the Tojo clan, and the Tojo clan, you never would have ended up like this in the first place. I hope you can forgive yep. me. Don't be like that, Kiryu-san. I can't imagine a Komorocho without you. This town owes you and Kazuma-san more than you realize. So please, there's no need to apologize. Take care of yourself, Kiryu-san. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. This game is starting off very depressing. Hi, Imoto! Kazuki will be fine soon enough. It's still some time until he'll be out on the street, but he's progressing nicely. Did you drop in on the Tojo clan yet? Nope, I'm not planning to. Daigo and Yaoi-san Yaoi have enough on their plates already rebuilding the organization. Besides, the Tojo don't need me now that Daigo's in charge. I wouldn't be so sure about that. It's all right, I left a letter for Daigo over with Kashiwagi-san. There's one thing I need, though. I need to see a certain someone before I leave Kamurocho for good. Majima. You're gonna ask him to look after Daigo, huh? Yeah, if we want all the other families to accept Daigo as their leader, we need a big man like Majima to come forward and do it first. Can't you just step in and if anyone starts giving him trouble? Why does it have to be Majima? I'm out of the clan, that's why. Besides... It's not that long ago that the Tojo wanted me dead. Even now, I have my fair share of enemies in the clan. Meaning the Mad Dog's your only option. That's right, none of the Patriarchs would dare mess with Majima, but if I Daigo can show he's got a him on a leash, the other families would have to follow suit. I get it, so you're gonna go see him now. Yeah, mind if I leave Haruka here for while I'm out? What, the girl? Oh, of course, of course, no problem at all. All right, time to go see my boyfriend, oh god. Yeah, I need to talk to Majima Sun before we leave. Can I come? No, you don't want to watch our foreplay. <laughs> I promise you. We have some adult things to discuss. 
he even said it himself. We have to discuss adult things with Majima. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Haruka, it has to be now. Time to go do adult things with Majima. <laughs> I have to track down someone in the family. Hello? Does he still work at Majima Construction? I mean, I'm sure he does. Oh, that's a, okay, can't go that way. Majima Construction, anyone? Hey, do you know about Majima Construction? Uh. Oh, a lot of trouble at Stardust. Hmm. It's fine. Oh my god. Huh? Look who it is! Oh my god, these punks again? So... Uh, did they really? Oh my god. Why? <laughs> Our senpai here is in the Cosmo family. Yeah, that's right. The guys who own this damn town. Well, you shitting yourself? Yeah, if they're in the Cosmo family, there is no way in, like, fucking hell that they don't know who I am. Everyone knows who I am. <laughs> oh. I got Cosma family pin right here. They don't go handing these out on the street, you know. I'm a big man. I might be able to find it in my heart to forgive you for a price. Huh? A Cosmo family pin, huh? Funny. Back in my day, nobody dare brag about their loyalty without knowing who they were up against. That's how you get yourself killed, kid. Not it? Well, just do yourselves a favor and run along now. I'm not interested in wasting my time with scum not like it? you. You think you can boss Cosmo family boys around? We're gonna bash your fucking brains in! <laughs> yeah! Cosmo family! God. <sighs> Defending? Defending is for pussies. Are they gonna attack me? Or, okay. I'm just standing here. Okay, there you go, there you go. Wow, that was hard. Just like standing over here doing nothing. Wait! That didn't kill him! Did bicycle go flying? Of course! Because bicycles always go flying! I'm still really offended that these guys don't know who I am. I don't understand how you don't know me. Everyone in Kamarocho should know who I am. No? Like, or am I going crazy? Level up ready? Whoa! Why would you want to redo the fighting lesson? No! <laughs> I am <Ero. laughs> Aniki, help! This guy's gonna fucking wreck us! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. We know who this guy is, apparently. Looks like he already did, Hiroshi. He start shit with you. He's got beef with the Cosmo family or something. 
Hold your horses there. You're the ones who started this, not right. me. Grr, shut up, you old bitch. Oh, well, if it ain't the fourth chairman, how you been? Huh? Mm -hmm. Don't haunt me. Go on and introduce yourself, idiot. This man here is Kazuma Kiryu. Tojo Clan fourth chairman. What? <laughs> You there, your Cosma family too? Yes, sir, the name's Anarchy, but you can call me Anarchy Anarchy. Okay. I think I'll just stick to Anarchy anyway. Do you know where I can find Majima san? Good morning, beautiful. Lilu, thank you so much for the 21 months. I appreciate it. Thank you for all the support. I really appreciate that a lot. That's a good question. Since you left the Tojo clan to start Majima construction, it's been impossible to know where he might pop up. Though, now that I think about it, he was actually scheduled for a meeting with the boss today. You might catch him over at the Cosma family office if you're lucky. Fourth chairman. My boys didn't offend you, did they? Yeah? They're just shaking their heads like fucking idiots! Nah, it was nothing. Kiryu's too good for this world. Oh my god. Uh, see, now I have more fans. After earning a certain number of experience points, you will be able to upgrade your abilities. No way. What? That's crazy. No emails. I'm not popular, I guess. I really hate this controller I'm using. I kind of want to switch, but I don't know how. On a side note. Like, I wish I could use this one instead. This one is, like, such an old... It's such a worn-down controller that I really... I don't want to do it. Oh, cool! This one works. Okay. I really need to ditch this old controller. Like, it's, it's really, really bad. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's so much better. Jesus Christ, this controller's a lot better. Okay. I can upgrade abilities. So we can go... We can learn two soul abilities. Hmm? Wait, I'm slightly confused. So you don't get a choice. a fight. Wait. I bumped into somebody. Are you kidding me? Uh... I didn't mean to. Save point. Um, okay. Examine the save point. Yes. How does this work? Uh. Okay. Overwrite. Yes. Oh god, is this gonna be a pain in the ass every time to save? Okay, you just saved! You don't need to save again. It does that automatically. I'm not telling it to do- I don't understand. Oh my god! Hat-donning man! Do you- Oh my god, is that Nishida? 
It's Nishida, right? What are you up to? <laughs> oh, well, the boss had some business with Kashiwagi-san, so I came over with him, but once we got here, he told me to just go home. The problem is, if I really do up and leave, I'll totally get chewed out later, so I'm sticking around for now. PS4 just does that? Oh, okay. Clearly, I don't play enough PS4 games. <laughs> I was actually heading over to see Majima-san myself. Is he still with Kashiwagi-san? Doubt it. The boss thinks meetings are the most boring shit in the world, so I doubt it lasted longer than a half hour. Then where is he now? On the roof, most likely, looking down on the city. He may not look it, but he's actually a big softy. Goro Majima, big softy? What? I'm sure he's torn up about you leaving Kamurocho, Kiryu-san. And hey, don't tell the boss I said he's soft. To think I'd end up losing an eye myself if he found out. I won't. Take care of yourself, Nishida. Before you go, the boss has been kind of catty lately. You might want to be careful. Who knows what'll set him off. You know what? Here, you should take this. Better safe than sorry. Oh my god, he gave me a health item. Oh god, we're gonna get beat up, aren't we? Oh no. I don't like this. We're gonna get beat up. Oh boy. He is sad that we're leaving. Oh no! Majum, are you okay? Oh no. Soro soro, Kamurocho kara kierun ka. He's sad. Ah, da kara anta o sagashite ita. Ah? Doi koto ya? What are you getting at, Kiryu-chan? I think I was pretty clear. You can't seriously want me going back to the Tojo. I do. Well, too bad. Ain't much point in it now. Plan's just not the barrel monkeys it used to be. Listen, Majima-san, Daigo has taken over as sixth chairman, but he can—he could end up in some trouble without a family of his own. Meaning you want my muscle backing him up? Please, your family's the only thing that can save the Tojo clan now. Gonna have to pass. Majima-san. Come on, kiryu chan you know what I'm like. Living life caged up like a damn shelter dog ain't my scene, and you know it. But that's exactly what I'm doing. Giving up my freedom to keep my family afloat. <sighs> but now you come marching up here, asking me to babysit your little protege on top of that? Sorry, ain't gonna happen. Somehow I knew that's what you would say. What? Majima-san, you want to be free, right? Uh. Yep. But instead you're feeling trapped. Yep. Well, then this is the perfect chance for you to break out. Huh? The flying shit are you talking about? Once Daigo takes over, there'll be no shortage of people for you to fight. You can go wild like you've never gone before. Oh. How's that? You can be his enforcer. Anyone ever even thinks about betraying Daigo, you get full license to put them back in line. You. Saying what I think you're saying, kiryu John? You bet. It's time Kamurocho sees what the Majima family can really do. So I'm not asking you to babysit Majima-san. I'm asking you to let loose, <laughs> because the more ass you kick, the better off the Tojo clan and Daigo will be. Sorry, this is a very, um... I'm reading between the lines here, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> How did the shirt... Okay. Oh, wait. That's a little bit more reasonable. How... He took off his blazer, and it was perfectly laying on the ground. Yeah, at least for Majima, it's only the blazer. It's not like a shirt underneath that he's also wearing. But you still can't do that. Kiryu-chan. Oh, God. 
See that? That is like a okay. Me too. It's very hard to get used to this, uh, like, very rigid type of combat. Ah! Ah! I just got stepped on by Majima, and I, I can't even be mad about it. Oh shit. I can't even be mad! That's the that's the best way to go, man. <laughs> you can step on me anytime, man. Please do, actually. <laughs> I just lifted him off the ground. I helped him up. I helped him up like an actual, like, like a bro. I have at this point.
Yeah, I did get a screenshot, so that means it did happen. But now, no longer. Like, oh, I, I can't show you. さみしくなるね、キリュちゃん。大悟のことを頼んだ。ええ。ただ一月がかりなことがある。なんだ。もし六代目がおかしな方向に進んでも、俺には止めることはできへんで。どういう意味だ。大悟。いや、六代目はあんたと同じで人を信じやすいところがある。変な連中に利用されなきゃいいんやが。大丈夫だ。大悟はそんなバカなことじゃない。そろそろ俺は行く。登場会のこと。頼んだぞ。いや、マジマ
Haruka? Okay, I gotta check the neighborhood. Um, I'm assuming that means going outside. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, this place is really pretty. What the fuck? Mira son, but I don't have time for small talk. Have you seen Izumi? Mm. Can't say I have. Have you checked down at the beach? I see her there starting staring out at the ocean every now and then. I imagine she spends that time reminiscing about her parents. She lost them at such a young age. Oh god. Um at the beach, at the beach, at the beach. Oh. You're usually the first one at the dinner table. What's wrong? I don't want to eat right now. What? Are you feeling okay? Something's definitely bothering her. Something happened at school? Come on, Izumi. You can tell me. Hey, Uncle Kaz? Is not having parents a bad thing? The other kids at school were making fun of me because I don't have a mom and dad. How'd that even get brought up? Well, bring your parents to school day is pretty soon, so everyone started asking what I was gonna do. They they said my parents can't come because they're dead. That's awful. Oh my god, what the fuck? Everyone knows I live here with you, Uncle Kaz. That is so fucked up! It's not like I want you to pretend to be my dad or anything, but... And what, Izumi? You can tell me. It's really hard. Like, some of the other parents can't come because they're too busy, but nobody makes fun of those kids. Why not? Why can't I have a real family like everyone else? You do have one. <laughs> Me, Haruka, and everyone else. I don't get it. Listen, families come in all shapes and sizes. Having a real mom and dad isn't what matters. What matters is that you're surrounded by people who love you for who you are. But we're not related. Well, there's more to it than that. Related or not, you mean the world to all of us. That alone is enough to make us family. And besides, I don't think your classmates were really making fun of you. They've spent their whole lives with their moms and dads right by their side. They can't imagine it any other way. I'm sure they just don't realize how lonely life as an orphan can be. Then they don't think I'm weird? That's right, if anything, I'd say they were genuinely concerned about you feeling lonely. I was an orphan too, I know how just how hard it can be. Even so, I'll always think of the man who brought me up as my real dad. And the other kids from my orphanage, they're my siblings. Throughout all my time there, the idea of not having a real family never even crossed my mind. So you see, you have everything you could ever need right here at Morning Glory. Your family is just as real as any of the other kids at school. You don't need to be jealous of them. I'm not! It's just they say some- they say things sometimes. And when they do, you can tell them this. I'm not alone. I have nine people in my family. Me, Haruka, and the others. That makes nine. We're family, huh? Mm. <laughs> You're <laughs> such a good dad! <laughs> uh, <俺はお前のお父さんにはなれない。笑> いずみちゃん、みんなが待ってるよ。朝顔に戻ろう。ほら、泣かないでもう。さあ、今日はカレーだ。戻って腹いっぱい食べよう。Oh. <laughs> Why is this so sweet? What the fuck are you?
They didn't even eat. Oh my god! I'm gonna cry. Oh. Look at this dad, dad of the year. Dad of the year. Oh my god, Kazuma, Kazuma Kiryu. Oh my god. Uh, I'm gonna cry. Yeah, can we clap it up for for dad of the year, Chet? That was so fucking wholesome. I can't, I can't. Eviction notice? Oh god! Wholesome moment. Crumbled up. Thrown out. Wow, pussies. Uncle Kaz, we don't have to leave, do we? Not if I can help it. I'm not about to let lo let those guys kick us out of our home. They must be Ryudu family boys. That's who's been sending us those letters. One way or another, it's gonna have to stop. I can't have them keep scaring you guys. Maybe I should pay this Ryudo family a little visit. Don't worry, Haruka. I'm not planning on getting into any fights, even if they are Yakuza. <laughs> be careful, Uncle Kaz. I will. Be back tonight. All right. You're not evicting me. I have I have the Dad of the Year award, you see. You will respect me in my dadness and you will uh back off of my orphanage. Oh, hi old lady. <gasps> Swarming with tourists. I was only trying to run some errands, but people kept stopping me to ask about nearly everything under the sun. I wish Okinawa wasn't so popular. If you're looking to pick up some ingredients for dinner, try the Kari Yushi Arcade or the public market. Oh, thank you. The Ryuno family has got to be somewhere around here. I guess I should start by looking for these guys from before. Pretty sure they were driving a little blue truck. Oh no, look at this turtle! We found another turtle. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Um. Oh god. Wait, is this like a whole new map? Okay, it's not that big. here. <laughs> Did you see those two guys eating ice cream in front of the convenience store? Oh god, this game gotta rub it in my face that I couldn't get ice cream earlier. Ugh. Sa, sa. Looked like a couple of country bumpkin gangsters, didn't they? I guess they have them They have them in Okinawa, too. I want ice cream! Uh, hey, look, it's Smile Burger! Oh, 
Oh, look at these bimbos. Yo, Chimpira. Hey there, punks. Fuck you! Nanda, Osan. Omaira. We've become friends or something, something. They wasted perfectly good ice cream. Don't bring it up. It's a sore subject. It's a sore subject. It's a sore subject. ナイチから写真出てきたやつが大嫌いなんだよ。とっとと沖縄からあ、<笑><笑> あ、いけ、今すぐ組に連絡を。わざわざ組に連絡入れるようなことするんじゃねえ。俺らの仕事はあんたの監視だ。だが、好き勝手に事務所に行ってもらうような真似されちゃ困るんだよ。そんなことされ
taking like no health off of this guy. What the fuck? What the fuck? I don't like this game. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I actually do like this game a lot right now. Are you joking? Well, rip us. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oops. Oh, wrong way, wrong way. How do you guard through all of that? I don't understand. Fight fair. There you go. Here, you like chairs? I like chairs. No! I press the button! You fuck! Ah! Jesus fucking Christ! Give me my heat back, you bitch! No! R2? That's such a weird button to push. I don't understand. Like, you can't even mash the R2 button. That's so hard. Or maybe I'm just bad, but like, what? Happy birthday? Wait, why are you saying happy birthday to me? You're two months too early. Yeah, Yeah, mashing R2, yeah, on the DualShock, but like an old PS3 controller would be easier to mash that. To the Ryudo office we go! Mikio, run on ahead and let the boss know that hey. we're coming. You said the Viper is a symbol of Okinawa, right? Then why'd you leave its eyes blank? Oh, well, my tattoo guy ended up passing away before he could get it all the finishing touches in, so I decided to just leave it that way. Can't you get someone else to finish the job? I mean, I've thought about it and all, but I don't know if some random other artist could do his work justice. Wouldn't feel right, you know? I guess. And with how important the Viper is, I gotta have someone who's real in tune with the soul of Okinawa. Haven't found anyone like that since my old guy died, though. No, one Okinawa has nothing to do with it. The best tattoo artist knows how to. The best tattoo artists know how to reflect a man's soul, no matter the theme. A master artist should be able to do your viper justice. Well then, I hope I can find one someday. The world's a big place. I'm sure you'll come across someone sooner or later. Ah, uh, this game. These games keep reminding me that I've been wanting my tattoo for like five years now, and I still haven't fucking gotten it. I need to buy drugs. I almost pushed that guy over. Okay. Where do, uh, uh, wait, map. There's only, like, two pla- what's down here? Oh god, that's a wall. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, I can't go down that way! Okay! Uh, god damn it! Okay, okay, okay! The M store! Okay, or, oh god. No! I need to buy health items! God damn it! 
I am dying! Oh, Jesus Christ. All right. I gotta follow him. Oh, that's a cute little jingle. Whoa, this place is cool. Oh, Rikia, where are you heading? You look like you're busting a dang gut over there. Nice. Just taking him to see the boss. That guy, wow, he's built. Making you look like a little kid with those tiny arms of yours. <laughs> Come on, man. Don't be like that. It was just a little joke. Hey, pal, you're not from around here, huh? Nope, but I've been on the island for almost a year now. Ah, uh, convert. How you like in Okinawa, friend? Probably never want to step foot on the mainland again, huh? Listen, man, we're kind of in a hurry, so... All right, all right, run along. Oh, and ask the boss if he wants to grab a drink tonight, will ya? Sorry about that. It's this way. What is this? Oh my god! What? That's not even a tail coming out of your ass! What? That's like a... Is that a fin? It's... A... That is not a tail. I, I don't... I know it's a shisa, but like... You can't tell what the poop turd is coming out of its butt. Anyway. <sighs> kind of in a hurry. Says the guy who spends all of his time sitting on his touche. Oh, called out. <laughs> you and Miki-chan spend more time lounging and getting around getting fat than doing actual work. <laughs> Got him. Not in front of the guest. What a guess he is. If only I was 20 years younger and I a couple inches taller. Mm -mm -mm. This old woman got taste. Is that shit all you old ladies think about? Seriously, you're embarrassing me here. What, and you don't? Don't act all innocent here. Bitch, please. We are all guilty. <laughs> I just uh, got some uh, nice bitter melon in, so I'll whip up a big old batch of Goya Champloo for you for you boys. May maybe I can bring it around the office later? I can't hang with that bitter shit, you know that. Anyway, t no time to be standing around. We gotta go. She's kind of nosy, okay. Seems like the locals are on pretty good terms with Ryudo. Seems to be that way. The old woman is dying of dehydration. Be thirsty. Ryudo family office, come on in. I feel like... Dozo. I'm gonna see if this makes me squint too much. I feel like I'll be fine. I'm going to take my father. Wait a minute. あんたに話があってきた。うちの力也が変わってもらったようだな。あんたに話があってきた。ああ、立ち退きの件だろう。そうだ。どうして俺らが立ち退かなきゃならないのか。わけが知りたい。うん。さっき。おいさっき。ち
Name Saki. You have a daughter? Not by blood. I took her in, uh, maybe three years ago. Now about those eviction notices. I'm listening. I'm real sorry to be doing this to you, but I don't have a ton of choice on the matter. And why is that? Well, the family's owned the land that you're sitting on for decades now. We built the houses over there ourselves and have been sub subletting them at subletting them since. But le when now the potential buyers come knocking and we not we're not planning on turning them down. Someone wants the land? Yep, sounds like it's going to be the site of some fancy schmancy new resort. What, you hadn't heard? This is my first time yet? Well, the word is they're going to plop a big resort on the land your little neighborhood's on now. Either that or it built or use it for a brand new American military base. It's been all over the news. So that's why you're trying to evict us. Yep, I've got to admit, my feelings are kind of mixed on the whole shebang, being Okinawa born and raised and all. But who am I to stand in the way of progress? So what do you say? Think of it as a favor. Me and the rest of the Uriido family will really owe you one. Look, Rikia told me about the orphanage. Trust me, I know from Saki how hard raising kids that age can be. But you mainlanders are practically made of money, right? Can't you just take your kids somewhere else? And if you really need some extra cash, we might be able to spot you a little something. Oof. Yikes. どうか。それじゃ、断る。ああ。なんだと。あんたの言い分は通っている。だがな。所詮それは極道の勝手な都合ってやつ。何? いいようにことを運ばせていた。キリュー。だがな。そんな俺たちの事情で振り回された子供はどうなるんだ。俺はな。ここで施設をやっているうちは。あいつらをそういう目に遭わせたくねえ。話は終わりだ。帰らせても
沖縄の内需拡大のためリゾートの開発を推し進めてきた鈴木氏意見の異なる両大臣揃っての沖縄訪問に政財界からの注目が集まっています田宮氏の現地到着に先駆け空港前には基地の拡大に反対する市民が大勢詰めかけ範囲を示すビラを配るなどする一方鈴木氏はリゾート開発による内需拡大を支持する地域財界関係者に迎えられ開発候補地の視察へと向かいました田宮氏の米軍基地拡大法案鈴木氏のリゾート開発ともに現地でも意見が割れており法案成立に向け両大臣とも各方面との調整が必要と思われます確かに BMD の導入は今の日本にとっては重要なことですしかしこれ以上沖縄に日本防衛のための犠牲を払わせるわけにはいきませんそれを少しでも軽減するためにも内需拡大を見据えてリゾートを開発することでなんとか地域の振興に貢献していきたいとそう考えているわけです国を守ることは私の責務だそれ以上言うことはない空港到着後インタビューに応じた鈴木氏とは対照的に神谷氏は足早に車に乗り込み現地の視察へと向かいました突然の両大臣の沖縄訪問に野党からは鈴木氏の沖縄リゾート開発に神谷氏が便乗する形で強引に米軍基地拡大法案を進めようとしているのではないかと疑問の声が上がっています地元の住民の反応はどうなんでしょうか基地がまた拡大するのは嫌だけどリゾートで沖縄が潤んだったらまあいいのかなってお隣の国がミサイルを撃つっつったって沖縄じゃなくて東京とかを狙うわけでしょタミヤさんはさ結局沖縄のことなんか考えてないんだよ次期総裁候補として呼び声の高い鈴木タミヤ両氏の沖縄での行動に今後も注目が集まります続いてのニュースです今のニュースここの立ち抜きの話なのかな Yup Yeah they're talking about the land that we're on That's why they're trying to kick us out You talk to those guys in the truck right? How did it go? They wanted to buy us out, but I turned them down. Somehow I doubt that's the end of it, though. Oh, Uncle Kaz? Are we gonna have to leave Okinawa? Don't worry, Haruka. I'm not gonna let that happen. Trust me. Everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> okay, I believe you. I almost forgot. Well, it's probably nothing, but Shiro's been kind of down since he got home from school. I wonder why. Did you, did you ask him what was wrong? <laughs> Yeah, but it didn't seem like he wanted to talk to me. Okay, I'll give it a shot. Thanks for letting me know. Time to find Shiro. I want to come up with a bomb and crystal theory for the whole game. What's that? But I don't have enough information of, like, characters and stuff. There's a dropper? I don't know what a dropper is. That also doesn't tell me what a dropper is. Is that like fishing line bait? Is that a. No. What's a dropper, chat? Because this description doesn't tell me. I, I thought it was like a fishing thing. It's a- oh, like an eye droplet. Oh, it's just called a dropper? I didn't know that, that those things had a name. Oh, it's like those things that you fill up and then you just go drip, drip, drip. Oh. Oh, okay. That's weird. Should I learn how to fish, chat? 
Fishing stream! Oh, never mind. No fishing stream. Oh, man. that That's depressing. That's really sad. Tai Chi bomb! Don't hit so hard, Tai Chi! There's more where that came from! Tai Chi explosion! I asked you a question, Tai Chi! Come on, Uncle Kaz. Can't you see we're busy here? Just take a break for one second. Do either of you know where Shiro is? Uh, maybe in our room? We asked him if he wanted to play with us, but he said no. Tai Chi blast! Hey, no fair! I wasn't ready! I'm glad you kids are full of energy. Just try not to get hurt, okay? We'll be careful. You're never careful. Guess I'll take a look inside. Tai Chi blast! All right, how do I navigate in here? Oh God, okay, so that's Haruka. This is our dinner table. That's the kitchen. Um, that's a calendar? Question mark? Uh, um, I haven't really explored this place much. Wow, everything seems very dirty. Do we ever clean up around here? Wait, leave? Wait, now I'm in the back. Oh, there's a backyard. Oh, and I can't turn the camera, oh God. Look at how angry Kiryu looks. Okay, so we apparently can go back here. Time to fish out Majima? Dude, that would be amazing. Holy shit. Okay. So we have yet to go to, like, the other half of the house. Just boxes in a corner over here? Okay. Uh, enter? What is this? Oh, that's the hideout. Oh. And that's, oh, shiny. Worm. <gasps> is that bait? I got bait. I got bait. I got bait. <laughs> Worm? No! I'm not gonna eat the worm! You guys are crazy! Why do you want me to eat the worm? No! Uh oh. Hey there, Shiro. Everything okay? I'm fine. You don't look fine. Everyone else is having fun outside, but you're sitting in here all by yourself. Are you sure you're okay? Just leave me alone! Something happened at school? No. Does it have to do with a girl? What do you mean? Well, you're at the age that boys start- That's not it! Just leave me alone! Does your stomach hurt? Do you want a worm? Oh. I have to talk to the other kids more. What's wrong with your friend, kid? What, uh, do you know what's wrong with him? <laughs> I'll put him in a headlock. Oh my god, no. No, we don't beat kids up for information. No! God, where do these kids learn this shit? Is this about Shiro? Yeah, something's definitely up. Uh, I'm not sure. We're not in the same grade. Different classes. Everybody wants to beat him up! What the fuck, dude? Uh, we don't want to be moving at our age. I couldn't live with some big apartment building where you don't even know your own neighbors. Did you hear about Kume-san? He agreed to sell his house. He said he's taking the opportunity to move in with his son's family. I guess they have a place on the mainland. Oh. Whee! I'm 
supposed to be talking to kids. Yay or nay? That's a good question. I'm against it, of course. Huh. The people on this island are sick and tired of the military imposing on our land. Besides, plopping more bases down is essentially saying we're preparing for war, and when that war inev inevitably comes, we'll be trapped in a combat zone with no escape in sight. Not to mention all this outrageous talk about erecting some fancy schmancy resort, as if that will make finally make Okinawa pr pr prosperous. If you ask me, they're trying to tear down everything we've worked for since the Second World War, all for a little pocket change. That is upsetting. Oh no, did I... Oh god. Wait, this takes me downtown, doesn't it? Uh, well, oops. Uh, can I... I need to buy, like, health items. Hello! Do you sell health items at whatever store you are? Oh, that's a pawn shop. Oh, I found the pawn shop. And there's T's on the map. We're gonna find out what all these markings mean. What is a T? Um. Oh, that's a taxi! Oh god, that's a taxi? It's a bicycle! Okinawa taxis are bicycles. Oh, that's cute. I actually really like that. Oh! Hey, I need this stuff! Holy shit, that's a lot of stuff. Catnip stick? Why do I need a catnip stick? Half of this shit is really concerning. What? <gasps> Sushi! Cars should be scared of Kiryu. Yes, they are. Sake! I can't buy too many sushi sets. Because if I do, then uh, I'm broke. Arigatou Return to the sushi. Yeah! I'm excited. I can finally eat my sushi again. Hopefully it doesn't turn into chains this time. Oh. Uh, why won't you tell me where Takia is? <laughs> man came by and took him. I don't know what to tell you, Kirubi-san. He said he was a friend of yours. He even had me listen to a message you left on his phone asking him to pick up Taka Takuya for you. But I, I didn't know such thing. Oh, I knew message. What does it say? We have Takuya. If you want him back, come get him. Alone. And leave the Kamuro PD out of it. Uh, Takuya, I can't lose you. I don't know what to do. Sounds like there's been a kidnapping. I should go see if she needs help. Okay. Mm -hmm. Who are you? I'm Kiryu. I run the Morning Glory Orphanage just down the road. If a kid's been abducted, well, you can understand my concern. So you're a teacher? All I know is that Takuya was taken from this hospital. And I just got a ransom note. We have Takuya come alone. And it's far too dangerous. We need to be- we need to alert the authorities. If I call the police and they hurt my darling Takuya, I'd never be able to live with myself. What on earth should I do? Please, Kiryu-san, can you help me? You take care of children every day. Surely you understand what I'm going through. Uh, Okay, I'm on it. Why do you? <laughs> I love that gift so much. <sighs> These graphics aren't that bad, though. I really like. I don't. I. I don't quite understand because maybe I'm just old and I'm just so used to playing old games that these graphics are just so. They're really not bad. 
It's like people are spoiled by good graphics nowadays that any slight any slight downgrading graphics and people are like bitching like crazy. Like, oh my god, this looks like Garbo! Why can I see pixels? Like, god damn, dude. Have you guys ever played a retro game that people that complain about these graphics? Like, Jesus Christ, this is so good. People be spoiled! I'm sorry I made you cry more. I tend to do that to people. <laughs> I make all the bitches cry. Are you the punk who kidnapped Takuya? Hand him I'm over now! Real. Who the hell are you, Kurumi's newest flame? Well, that's just perfect, because you're g about to get flamed. Okay. The animations for walking are kind of bad. Again, have you ever played like an older game? I don't think, I really don't think much of this is bad. Like sure, it's clunky, it's gonna be clunky. It's an older game. But like, it's really not bad. Wait, people complained about the graphics of Ghost of Tsushima? Oh, wow. Yeah, I think that gamers be spoiled nowadays with graphics. Oh my god. The thing is, I grew up, like, I still play... I don't really play a lot of PC games. I still play a lot of older games. And... Nintendo. So you can imagine that I'm not used to playing games that have insane graphics. I'm really not used to it, to be honest. Because we all know that even the Switch is, like, behind the times on graphics. And, uh, so, like... Anything that's, like, anything that has amazing graphics, I'm always amazed by it. Because I, I live constantly with older games, and... I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I, I myself have not gotten into the era of, like, new good shit, I guess. Takuya's a dog? He's a very important part of my family. I'm the one who gave you this mutt. Oh my god. You use that voicemail to trick the vet of all the down, low down, nasty things to do. You're twisted. Ew. Can we just beat this guy up? I got 10,000 yen? Oh, thank you. But yeah, I don't know. This game really isn't that bad. <laughs> Whenever people were talking about this game, they were like, Oh my god, the graphics are so bad, you're gonna hate it. And I'm I'm sitting here like, Okay, but like, why Kiryu is kind of great. <laughs> I'm living for this. This is great. The OG Yakuza 3 or- No, I think they were talking about the remaster, how people were upset that the remaster really wasn't that much of an upgrade. How do I leave this town? Oh, Jesus Christ! You just came running at me. Oh, God. Wait, what, what the fuck did, what did I just get myself into? What the fuck? I just... was fun. His boy is dead. <laughs> it's big upgrade. Oh, oh. Yeah, I mean, like, I can understand that if it... But didn't this remaster come out after, like, Kiwami? 
Or no, it's not, no, it's not, not after, before Kiwami. So, like, it would make sense that it's not going to be as good as, uh, like, Kiwami graphics. Because it can Oh, it was after. Oh, well, that's a bit strange. They make Kiwami and then they don't do the same treatment to this. Okay, that's a, that, this is a, that's a little strange. But maybe they just didn't have the time or something, I don't know. Gotcha, gotcha. So because these were like the PS3 era, they didn't give it the same treatment. Well, I think that would uh, require a lot more work for them that probably wouldn't pay off in the end. So I, I kind of don't blame them for it. Wait, how am I? I'm just walking around. Can you leave me alone, buddy? Oh God, battles in this game are a little annoying. <laughs> what did I do to deserve this? <laughs> Is it still fine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really don't see a problem with these. I'm, I'm enjoying this so far. But I will say the main reason I play an RPG is pretty much for the story. I, I don't really care about graphics or much else. As long as you give me a good old story, I'm a happy camper, man. I'm a simple gamer. Good story, me happy. I got an impressive 5,000 yen. Okay, I genuinely don't know how to go home. I got here. I think we enter through the top. I should, maybe I should just explore the city more. I shouldn't be shy. I should, I should hang out a bit. Get to know the town a bit. So what's this way? There's a... Shogi! Okay. Yeah, I'm getting to know the town. See, that looks like a punk that wants to beat me up on the street. Maybe if I just go all the way around him? <gasps> yeah, that's good. It's just like, I mean, that's the same thing with Persona 5, right? Like, Persona 5 really uh, made Persona a lot more of a popular series in the West. Yakuza 7 did the same thing for the Yakuza series. Okay, now I'm at a dead end. Okay, this is, this is just a dead end? Okay. Wait, you're chasing me. Stop chasing me! Bitch! Okay, I genuinely am... I'm so confused. Okay. Oh. Okay, I can zoom in. Holy shit, okay. There's a Mahjong camp. Oh, karaoke. Wait, I passed up karaoke! Oh my god. Fuck! Turn around, turn the ship around! Oh God! You're you're are you, is this karaoke? Yes, I must say. Yes. Yeah, now I feel like I'm really playing Yakuza. Are these all new songs? Where has your touch gone? Whoa! I want to change myself and we're doing lively interjections. All right. Ooh, finally new songs.
This is awkward. Is he singing Haruka Oi? Okay, this is awkward. Uh, uh, fuck. I'm pressing the button! Press it harder. Clearly, I'm like actually pressing it harder though, because I'm like, I think it's gonna work better. <laughs> That was a cute song, though. I did bad. No, don't make fun of my score. Oh, God. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Oh, God. Get it off the screen. Get it off the screen. Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, that's great. Next song. Next one, next one, next one. Okay, uh, Kamurocho Lullaby. <laughs> the beat mapping takes time to get used to. Clearly, yeah, I found that out. Oh, this song got a good start. Oh, Jesus. Here you got a good voice. I feel like this really shows it off. Dang, Kiryu, go off! Dang! No baka mitai. Maybe it's a sign, because baka mitai is like depressing, right? So without baka mitai in this game, that's the game's way of telling me that this is not going to be a depressing game. Oh god, they give me like the sad music, like, haha, you suck! Alright, fine. Oh no, my time's up! No, wait! Wait, no! I'd like more time, please! Oh, wait, no, no, no. Uh, wait, no! Oh, fuck, I kept clicking A. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Too late now. I guess we're doing this one again. <laughs> no! I'll take it, whatever. All right, I did so bad. This is my redemption arc. Oh my God, and I missed the first note. Oh, 
Oh, these are only simple interjections, too. Oh my god, what the fuck? Ugh. Why is this so hard? I'm not bad at rhythm games, I swear! Uh, this is whack. I don't think I did any better. We'll come back to this one at a later time. Not now. I'm depressed. Oh god. We didn't do any better! I think that's literally what I got the first time. God damn it, this is so hard! Oh, this sucks. Okay. Uh, I want to sing this one. Where has your touch gone? Because that sounds lewd. easier because it's just on the beat. Is that it? 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 Oh, jeez. I did better! We did better! Improvement! Improvement! Hey! There's no, there's no, like, um, animations, though. Or not animations, but, like, the, the little cutscenes in the background. I'm out of here, man. I'm depressed. I'm not good at this game. Am I just sucking so bad that they're not popping up? Because I think that's what's happening is I'm too bad and then the game's like, nope, you don't get that extra little scene to play. And now I'm just sad. Okay, how do I go home? I'm- I'm lost. I got here somehow. Um... <laughs> I think it was down the main street. Okay, I think I think I got this. 
Yes, I sucked that bad. Uh. Fuck. When you suck so bad and you don't get fun. All right, I think I need to go down this main street and probably either go right or left, but I think I came from this direction. Did I come from here? I'm just gonna run in until I can't run any further. Um, oh, nope, okay. Uh, nope, not that way. Where do you come from? What is back here? Shady back alley. Okay. I'm- I'm lost. Ah! <laughs> no! Maybe it's the other direction. I don't think I came from the other direction. Guys, this is- this new map is, uh, oh god. Terrible. Oh my god, I'm running in the middle of the street. I really shouldn't be doing this. Yo, Mr. Makey! Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Thank you for the two months. <laughs> oh, this is fun. Oh, not that way. Yeah, I was gonna say, wait a second. We came from this direction. Okay, I think it's like this way. And whenever I originally came here, it was like from this way and then up. So I think it has to be somewhere this way. I will find- I will figure this out, chat. Don't worry, don't worry. I- I- I'm- I'm very intelligent when it comes to this stuff, of course. Okay. Do I take the train? I thought I came from, like, here-ish somewhere? Where do you want to go? Oh! Morning Glory Station. I just have to go up the stairs, are you kidding me? Hey, I found out how to go home. Hey, I'm home! Okay, so... I'm supposed to be cheering up a kid, and I just left him behind. Like the asshole that I am. Oh, God. Haruka, do you know anything? Haruka, where are you? I thought you were in here. Let's try this again. We talked to two kids, but they didn't know anything. Oh god. No! I gotta take care of my kid problem. Oh fuck, I need dad of the year. How can I be dad of the year if I don't even know- Uh, jeez. I don't know what's wrong with my kid. And I can go in this room. Wait, I forget what's in this room. I did. I ditched the kids. Oh, that's the hideout. I ditched the kids for karaoke and I feel bad about it. Feels bad, man. <sighs> Sometimes, you know... Uh, I mean, I also have uh, some sake I can drink. You know, dealing constantly with a bunch of kids' problems. Sometimes it makes you want to drink. Haruka, do you know anything? He wasn't too keen on talking. I could have sworn he'd open up to you, though. I'm sure someone knows something. I just asked all the kids at the front, though. What the fuck? Come on. I gotta ask these kids again? I'll ask the kids that are fighting down here. <sighs> he's been doing that a lot lately. Probably because he's being... He's been getting bullied! I found him crying in the boys' room at school a couple weeks ago, so I asked him what was wrong. And that's when he told you about the bullying? Yeah. I think it's been getting worse, though. What makes you say that? Well, I thought it'd be funny to barge in on him when he was taking a bath, but he had bruises all over his body. Oh. <sighs> and he doesn't do sports or nothing, so he wouldn't have gotten them from that. Mm -hmm. The bullying always gets worse if you tattle. Besides, I've heard of enough. I'll talk to the teacher myself.
Ryuk uh, Ryukyu Elementary, Hashimoto speaking. My name is Kiryu from Morning Glory. The orphanage, right? You must be the guardian for all those poor kids. Who are you exactly? Oh, just one of the teachers here at the school. Oh, we got a face now. <laughs> it's like I just picture the face, it's there. I'm actually calling one of the kids Shiro. Could I speak with his teacher? That would be me, what seems to be the problem? Well, I have a reason to believe he's been getting bullied. What evidence do you have of that? Is this some kind of joke? Trust me, I'm not the joking type. Shiro's holed up in his room right now, not talking to anyone. Apparently there have been bruises on his body too. There is no chance such awful behavior would take place at our school. What about the other orphans? Who knows what those kids of yours get up to without parents around to keep them in check? Honestly, I'm sick and tired of all these nervous parents whining to me about their children. Raise them is your responsibility, not mine. Though, I suppose your case may be a lost cause. Goodbye, Kiryu-san. I want you to tell me what happened. You can trust me, Shiro. Please, all I want for you is for you is to be to be as happy. You and everyone else here. I'm going I'm not going to just stand around doing nothing when you're so clearly in need of help. What are you, Kiryu's face right now. It's so dep Oh my god. Is someone bullying you? All right, I'll have a talk with your school. You can't! I already spoke to your teacher, but he wasn't a whole lot of help. Shiro. Aww, Shiro. Why doesn't Shiro want me to go to his school? There has to be a reason. Maybe I could just cut out the middleman and talk to this bully's parents directly. Taichi seems to know a lot about what's been going on. He might be able to point me in the right direction. Uh-oh, he's not at the beach anymore. Where'd he go? I passed him. Don't talk- we don't talk about it. <laughs> Are you serious? I just want to talk. <laughs> I'm living for the wide Kiryu memes. This is so good. Don't tell anyone about this, but do you think you can find out who's been playing Shiro, Shiro for me? I already know, that's what I was trying to tell you before. Mm. Some kid named Yoshinori, but... It's kind of complicated. Yoshinori is the son of Shiro's teacher, Hashimoto. Are you sure? Hashimoto would be in big trouble if he admitted his own son was a bully. So I don't know if he'll ever fess up. Well, now I really need to get involved. I'd better check with Shiro again to make sure. <gasps> Sparkle! <gasps> Worm! I love that worm sparkle. I get really excited over worms. It's really... That's sad. Shiro, Taichi told me about what's been going on. Has the teacher's son really been bullying you? Why didn't you tell me sooner? Please, Shiro, I need you to talk to me. But Yoshimori, he said... He said his dad plays golf with Akasa-sensei from the city council. That he'd get him to shut Morning Glory down if I tattled on him. Guess the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. It's okay, Shiro, don't cry. I'm not crying, I'm just frustrated. Yoshinori only picks on kids when he knows they're not gonna fight back. It's not right. Morning Glory's not going oh. anywhere. Huh? I promise. So the next time he tries to mess with you, I want you to stand up for yourself. You hear me? Oh. The next day. I'm gonna fix this somehow. Okay, what are we gonna do, Kiryu? How can I solve the problem? Who would 
go after a sweet kid like Shiro-kun. I'd like to give them a piece of my mind. Well, it's a kid named Yoshinori, but his dad's the real problem. Apparently, he's pretty tight with the Akas... Akas... Aka... Akasaka... Akasaka-sensei. Jesus. Meaning if I don't go about this the right way, they'll get city council to come shut down my orphanage. That's some, that doesn't seem like the Asakasa-san I know. Wait, you know him? Of course, he's famous around these parts. Well, as famous as a city councilman can be. Anyway, he's definitely the honest type, not the kind of guy to use his position to settle grudges. Why don't you go talk to him? He loves chatting with his con constituents, and so I'm sure he'd be willing. Even so, I can't go marching into City Hall over this. Maybe if there was somewhere else I could run into him. Why don't you try the golf course? That's where he spends most of his free time. They say he wouldn't be caught dead without his trusty set of clubs. Apparently he loves it so much he forgets to eat sometimes, but golf balls can't fill an empty stomach, you know? Okay, so now I gotta head for the golf place. Let's go. Oh, don't worry, we're gonna fuck this kid up. Or not kid, but person up. Multiple people up. You can now take a taxi or a monorail trip to the golf course. Well, that's highly convenient. Um, there's a save right here. Okay, we're gonna save and then we're gonna go. We'll do a new save data. Sushi with the councilman. That would be pretty epic. I would love to have some Wagyu, personally. That'd be quite nice, that'd be quite nice. So now I have to figure out how to take the taxi, which I'm assuming is this? Okay. Well, this is the, that's the subway, the train. We figured it out. Gaming. Yes, I'm sorry. Are you a member of our club? Well, no. This is a highly exclusive club for local businessmen and government officials only. If you don't have an invitation from a current member, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. Hello. If you'll allow me to intrude... I hear you don't have a guest pass. In that case, why don't you join me for a couple hours? I was actually meant to meet up a, meet a friend here, but it seems he won't show up. I suppose he had some last minute business to attend to. I'm not too fond of playing by myself though, so if you wouldn't mind joining me, I'd be glad to have you along. Who are you? <laughs> of course, plot convenience. Of course, this is Akasaka. <laughs> talk about luck. This is the perfect chance for me to get closer to Akasaka. Yeah, talk about luck. Oh, I actually have to play golf? No! Okay, let's go. Press the triangle to change the shot range. Oh, okay. I... I'm gonna fuck that up so bad. I can just go directly in the hole, but then I have to go through all the trees. Um, so they said- oh, that's the impact point. Uh, club. I need to change my club.
A nine iron. No, that's a that's a putter. I don't want a putter. Okay, so it goes from like a three iron to a nine iron and then five wood. Okay. Let's do this one. Maybe. Nah, okay, three iron. We're doing three iron! I'm just gonna go straight, and then, um, uh, then I do this? <laughs> Wait, I fucked up. Oh god, we fucked up for ba- Okay. Yeah, I wanna retry it. Yeah. Okay, so I gotta hold it in. Wait, no, I want that- No! I'm very confused. Why am I golfing that direction? Wait, how do I change the direction? I don't understand. Oh, the wind is at the top too. Oh God, okay. So, let's just see how this works. Wait. <laughs> I'm so confused. I'm confused about the X button. So you start the swing. Do I hold it? Do I hold in the button? I know it just taught me, but like... I just press it once and then I press it again. God damn it. No, don't change the club. No! Actually, you know what? Fuck it. I guess we're gonna go. Let's just go go big or go home at this point. Okay. So, let's, uh... Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. I need to press all my buttons. Um... Okay, but yeah, it's the, it's the hitting part that I have a str that I struggle with. The hitting part. Now I didn't hit it at all. Okay. So if I... Let's try holding it in this time. Stop defaulting me to a fucking... One wood. No! <laughs> okay. Oh, I do have to hold it in. Oh, okay. I see. I see. I see. I see now. Because you're... Okay. I get it now. I think. I hope. I hope I get it. Jesus Christ. I'm sorry. I'm really dumb. I am not the sharpest tool in the, sh in the shed. I know how to play golf. Just not in a video game. Wait. I held it in. Wait. I don't understand. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> I don't understand how to press the X button properly! What am I not understanding? <laughs> it just says you start swing, build power, set impact timing. So I need to press it whenever it's back. Down? <clears throat> oh, that's why, because I'm letting it go all the way to the end. Okay, so maybe I just need to match it. Okay, okay, fine! I, I swear I'm not stupid. I actually, I really can't promise that, but. Okay, progress, progress, progress. I got it. We're, we're getting there, we're getting there. Progress. So you do just press it. I'm gonna just stick with this guy. Why am I doing this? Oh! <gasps> Wait, I thought that was like optimal. I, okay. <sighs> Fuck. 
This game is lying. Yep. I thought that's exactly how you wanted to time it whenever it goes back. I'm so confused. So let's do a test swing. So you do that. So that's me holding it. So if I hold down X. But I have to let go at some point. Actually, no, that's... <coughs> what the fuck? That was perfect! Okay, I no longer know how to play this and... D fuck it. Fuck it all! Fuck it all! <coughs> That's it. Alright. I'm not redoing it. Nope, nope, we're done. We're done! Do I really have to make it all the way to the end? They're forcing me to suffer! This is bullshit! <coughs> oh my god. Uh, I should have cur uh no we're not retrying it no fucking no we just we're just gonna God, Jesus Christ <laughs> oh I went farther that time wait a second I think I get it now I'm just you know we're in here now wait a second I get it. Oh. All right. This is terrible. Oh my god. This is like a this is like my fifth stro stroke number 5. Oh god, this is pitiful. I'm not really hitting that hard. Okay. Yards. Jesus Christ. So if I want it to be more powerful, okay, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. I'm just gonna keep doing it. This guy's gonna laugh at how bad I am, but I don't give a fuck. There we go. Right in the bunker. I was going for that. That was completely calculated. That's unfortunate that it took me so long to understand, but hey, I get it now. I only get the choice of two putter- Wait, they said I could do half the power. That, yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Fuck it! Uh, We're gonna do that half power thing again. Oh, I'm almost on the green. We're almost on the green. We got this. We got this. Stroke number 10. Oh, holy shit. <laughs> That's going to go so far. Okay. Nope. Okay. We did it. We did it. We did it. All right. Now we got to whip out the putter. All right. My turn. Oh, they already whipped out the putter for me. Uh, do I have anything? Okay. Putter time. The greens are angle- okay, okay, I see the elevation. Alright, we take the wind into account. Oh shit, I didn't- I barely hit the ball, oh god. Well, I want to redo on that one. <laughs> Holy shit! Got him. <laughs> Plus seven. This guy's like that. He actually got par. Okay, fuck you. I think I hit a little too hard. Don't worry. That happens to everyone when they first start out. All you need is some more practice. Whatever. Okay. Okay, but if this was real golf, I'd kick your fucking ass.
It's not easy, sure, but nothing makes me happier than seeing them smile. That's wonderful. I'm glad to know you enjoy your work here, Yusan, and what vital work it is. Another hole? I gotta do another one? God, this camera sucks. <laughs> it's like very inverted or something. I don't know if I need it. Okay. Uh, I got this, right? Hmm. Out of bounds. Okay. Uh, well, I hit it a little too hard that time. Holy shit. Oh, God! I hit it on the right side of the ball. That's why it went that way. Okay, where the fuck is my ball? <laughs> oh, God. Jesus Christ. <clears throat> oh, God. Out of bounds again. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> why is this game so hard? Oh, God. Why is the... I'm, am I hitting that button by accident? I'm hitting it on the right side. I meant... Uh. Hmm. There you go! Are you kidding me? That's... Oh. <gasps> Not bad. Not bad. We take those. We take those. We take those. Uh... Yikes. Okay. <laughs> We're on the green. But I'm gonna... No, we take it, we take it. I should probably use a putter. <laughs> yeah... Yeah... Okay, we got this! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Holy! Oh, guys, I didn't want to become a golfing stream. <laughs> Actually, I should have just taken that. I'm not retrying. I, I hate that the default is like to retry shots because I actually don't want to anymore. He got it in two. He got a birdie. Okay, fuck this guy. <laughs> Dude's just showing off at this point. So... Give up. Speaking of the orphanage, curious on how many kids you have there? Nine, all in elementary school. And you take care of them all by yourself. Do you have any helpers? No, but the oldest girl, Haruka, takes on a lot of that responsibility. She'll be starting sixth grade next month. And the chores are divided up between all the kids. Everyone has to help out. How wonderful. Too many kids these days sit around watching TV while their parents do all the work. What? I literally know no parents that do that. They make their kids do all of the work. What? Plus 16. I'm so good at the game. As a professional curious on, what are your thoughts on the youth of today? 
Things were definitely different whenever I was a kid, but with how drastically the world has changed, I guess that's not too much of a surprise. I'd say the real problem is that we spoon-feed everything to kids nowadays. There's no room for imagination anymore. Back in my day, we'd come up with games we could all play together when we were bored. And since we had lots of kids of different ages, we had to make rules that were fair to everyone. We didn't want to exclude anyone just because of their age or ability. It was through those playground games that we first learned about cooperation and what it means to help others. These days, though, it's all about video games and the internet. From what I hear, most kids would rather stay in their rooms than go outside than to play. What? No! No, 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 no. What are you talking about? True, we didn't have any of those luxuries when we were young. Children nowadays certainly have it good, but in, in a way, I feel sorry for them. Bullying seems to have grown more prevalent as well. I will admit, it's always been present, but incidents appear to be even more malicious recently. Perhaps the children of today lack basic consideration for their fellow students. Looks like it, yeah. I gotta do another one? No! Spare me! You fucking idiot! God, no! Why? Do I deserve this? <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! How do you get perfectly in the middle of this split? How? Are you joking? <laughs> I do that? I don't understand. Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh, good shot. Legendary. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Where am I going? I, I got this, right, right, right. <laughs> Bogey, huh? <laughs> Plus four. Better? Improvement. I have another question about your children, if you don't mind. How do they spend their free time? Well, we don't have any a computer or any games, so for the most part, they all play together outside. All the older kids really look after the younger ones, too. It's like we're one big family. That sounds lovely. Would it be all right if I paid you a visit sometime? Of course, I'd be glad to have you. Please, I do not want to play this game anymore. I'm so done. <laughs> Golf isn't much without an enjoyable conversation to go with it. I hope I'll have the chance to stop by your orphanage sometime soon, and I mean that sincerely. Perhaps there's even some way the city could support all the charitable work you do for, these, for those children. If you ever need anything, please feel free to give me a call. I'll do everything within my power to help you. I appreciate that. Get me out of here. Just get me the fuck out of this building. Before I forget, I signed you up for on a permanent guest list, so you'll be you'll be free to visit the club whenever you please. I will never come back here ever again. Thank you, though. Perhaps we'll even play again sometime. 
funny. Yeah, I'm never coming back. But thank you. Never again. Hmm. No! Wait! Oh, fucking hell. Oh. We are not playing golf again. No. I'm not gonna lie though, I do miss playing golf IRL though. Good to see you again, Kiryu-san. I told you I'd stop by, didn't I? Yeah, though I wasn't expecting it to be so soon. Yeah, you beat me home. What the fuck? Hey, Crystal, love <laughs> watching your streams. Besides, which has been your favorite Yakuza character so far besides Majima, because he is everyone's favorite. Majima is the only character in this whole series. Thank you so much, Kalori, for the five months. I appreciate it. I don't really... Uh, besides, uh, besides that, probably Sarah. Which, Sarah's not dead, by the way. Taichi is in the house! Yo, Uncle Kaz! Hey, you forgot to say hello to our guest! Take your shoes off before you go inside. Hi, Uncle Kaz. Welcome home. You two have a good day at school? Mm-hmm. Oh, a guest. Konnichiwa. Hi, mister. Hello there, kids. Come on, Izumi-chan. Okay. <laughs> if you ever want to know if I'm going to play a game, exclamation point games in the chat. I have a giant list of games that I plan on playing. Tadaima! Oh. Oh, no. <笑>元気な子供ですな。あれ、お客さん。ああ、挨拶しろ。初めまして、シロです。ほう、ちゃんと挨拶もしっかりできて気持ちのいい子だ。おい、あんたが桐生だな。この子供にあんたはどういう教
everyone's a big happy family here. This is so wholesome. Mm. This is a Yakuza game, right? Where's the Yakuza? <laughs> Sounds like Taichi and Ay Ayako are up in arms over something. I better go take a look. Oh, you know what? I am not mad about Dad Simulator. This is a breath of fresh air. This is kind of nice, actually. Just give me my money back. I I don't have it right now. Can you wait until I get my allowance? That's not till next week, and the new Ninja Rangers manga comes out today. All the kids at school are gonna read it before me. I'm sorry, Taichi. Uh, whatever. You better pay me back soon, live face. Aww. Why didn't you pay Taichi back, Ayako? Did you lose the money or accidentally spend it? Um, come on, this isn't like you. When you borrow something from someone, you have to make sure you give it back. But, I... Don't be afraid. You can tell me. Someone stole it! One of the other kids? Are you sure? Maybe it just fell out of your pocket. No, I keep all my money in my wallet inside my bag. So whoever stole it would have to know where it was there. All right, I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. Ayako, we have to find out what happened. I'll go round up the others. Wait for me in the dining room. Oh, we're solving all the kids' problems. Hey, did you steal money? Can you two go to the dining room for me? What's wrong, Uncle Kaz? Nothing really, we just need to have a family discussion. Hmm. Bullying orphans ain't cool. Oh. Go into the dining room. Don't ask what the kids are doing. Hey, you know, kids do some weird shit. You just don't question it. I did some weird shit as a kid, because you had to use your imagination. Before I got my, um... What is this? Before I got my Game Boy... Uh, Game Boy SP. That was like my big first uh, thing that I got. When did I get that, though? I got a Game Boy whenever... A uh, Game Boy Color was my first one. Game Boy Color, I think, whenever I was like seven? But before that, you know what I would do a lot growing up? I used to play house. Uh, but it's like a thing that my sister and I made up. We like made up this game by playing, uh, it was with chalk. We would, we would use chalk on our front yard and on the, on our front sidewalk at our house. For some reason, chalk was big in our family. I love chalk. That shit's cool. Bootleg Super Nintendos. We did have a Super Nintendo as well, but as far as like portable console, the Game Boy Color like changed my life. Ah. Uncle Kaz, you gotta help. I gave Ayo Ayoko some money, but she's not giving it back. Why won't you do something? I am. Go wait in the dining room. Is that all the kids? I don't think I counted all the kids. We have chalk. Yeah, chalk was cool. I played a lot with chalk, okay? Uh, we're missing one kid? Mm. 
go away. All right, so Haruka's there now. Is that everyone? No, we're still missing a kid. Where the fuck is the last kid? God damn it! Oh, Play-Doh was dope. But I actually, I, I, I didn't play a lot with Play-Doh. But when I did, those th those times were nice. Oh, there you are. Haruka's power walk. It's funny. Look, we don't question it. Ayuko's really worried, and rightfully so. The money got taken right out of her wallet, after all. Now, I don't like doing this any more than you do, but if one of you stole the money, I need you to speak up. When did you first notice it was gone? I think it was two days ago. Alright then, did any of you notice anything weird going on? Were there any strangers hanging around or anything? I think I saw something. Ryota was digging around in Ayoko's bag. Ooh. Ayoko-chan said I could borrow her paint, so I was getting it out of her bag. I don't think I stole the money. Do you, Uncle Kaz? Of course not. Now that I think about it, didn't Mitsuo just buy a new model set? It's a pretty fancy one, too. Kind of suspicious timing, don't you think? Well, Mitsuo, how did you get the money for something like that? Huh? I saved up for weeks, that's how. I didn't do anything wrong, Uncle Kaz. I even stopped buying snacks so I could save up quicker. Don't they say the first guy to speak up is usually the one who did it? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> you heard me. Stop it, you two. <laughs> All right, we're done here. This was clearly a mistake. Somebody stole the money, right? Yeah, he's right. Look, we're not gonna keep sitting here flinging accusations at each other. That's not what being a family is about. But I'll say it again. If no one- if one of you did take the money, you can come talk to me whenever you want. I won't tell the others. Such a good dad. The only thing that accomplished was making everyone doubt each other, although we'd be missing a lot more than Ayoko's money if the thief had come from outside. So as much as I hate to admit, one of the kids must have stolen it. Guess the only other option now is looking through their things. One of the kids is the culprit. Alright, we gotta find whoever the most sus one is. Oh my god, the crayons with 64 colors? Yeah! Back then it was really hard to get uh, crayons, like the big crayon boxes that had a lot of variety. Most of them were like the small 16 sets. That's Ayoko's bag, right? You know you can't dig around in there without her permission. Come on, just tell me what you were doing. Or is the reason you don't want- is there a reason you don't want to say? I love the walk! <laughs> it's so much funnier when it's a kid power walking. Uncle Kaz, what's wrong with Ari? I found her looking through your bag. Huh? Actually, the money's back in my wallet. Oh. What? Ari gave it back! Oh, She didn't want to get caught. Ari, where'd you go? Ari! Did you go down to the beach? Oh, shiny! Is this always a worm? Just infinite worms spew out of this one spot in the ground. I'm sorry, Uncle Kaz. I'm really, really sorry. 
I promised my friends I'd go to the movies with them, but I didn't have any money. Then why'd you promise? I never get to do stuff with them. They have real parents, so they get way more allowance than I do. And I have nine of us to take care of, so... And you have nine of us to take care of, so I can't ask for more. My friends know I can't afford a lot, so they never ask me to do stuff with them. So when they asked me to go to the movies, I was really happy. I couldn't say no to that, so I just took the money. I was gonna give it back next time I got my allowance, I swear, but I'm sorry, Uncle Kaz. I'm glad you were planning to pay her back, but you can't borrow something that's not yours without asking first. That's stealing. Mm. You gave the money back, and now you've confessed, too. That's really brave of you. Oh, Best dad of the year! Oh my god! The next step now is apologizing to Ayako. Think you can do that for me, Eri? I made everyone so mad. Nobody's gonna forgive me, especially not Ayuko. Oh, The best freaking dad, man. He's so good at this whole dad thing. Oh! This is this is like a parenting 101 game and I am here for it. そしてごめん。なんで<笑> その場でエリちゃんのこと止めてあげられなかった。This <笑> Wholesome. Come on, you two, let's get back inside. <sighs> Everyone's so angry. I wonder what they're gonna do when they find out Ari took the money. I mean, Koji and Riona are already fighting. What do we do, Uncle Kaz? Nobody's gonna hate anyone. I'll tell you what, leave the talking to me. What I need you two to do is. <laughs> Got it? <laughs> I'm so sorry, Uncle Kaz. Let's get everyone in the dining room. Okay, I'll go round them up. Me too! It's a very serious crime game, yes. Of course, yeah, because it's a very serious crime game. Hey, more worms! Just kidding. This camera is really wonky. All right. Now to make everyone not hate each other. Listen up, we got Ayoko's money back. Then you know who the thief is. Not so fast, I actually have to apologize to all of you. Well, Ari came to me yesterday saying she found some money, but I guess it slipped my mind today. How much was it? A thousand yen, which is exactly how much you were missing, right, Ayako? Meaning there's a good chance the money Eri found yesterday is the same money that went missing from Ayako's bag. There's no other possibility, don't you guys think? Mm. Mm. So then nobody stole the money. Why was I getting blamed for it? I'm sorry, Mitsuo. All of this could have been avoided if I had just remembered sooner. Everyone, I'm really sorry. Sorry, 
he's not good enough. Yeah, I got called a thief. Yeah, me too. Hold on, guys. Wait, I'm the one who dropped the money, so if you guys are gonna get mad at anyone, get mad at me. Yeah. Uncle Kaz was just a little forgetful. I think we should get be glad none of us turned out to be thieves. Oh. Eh, whatever. I probably deserved it for how I treated Koji. Hey, it's all in the past now. Oh, I'm just glad I got my money back, though now I'm realizing I'm starving. Where's... When's dinner, Uncle Kaz? I want to eat, too. Me, three. Oh, God, dinner. Right. Yeah, let's get moving. Go play outside while we cook. All right. Yeah, Kiryu doing chairman stuff. This is... See, it's funny because I actually feel like uh, his experience in the Yakuza has primed him for these kinds of situations in a very weird way. <laughs> he knows how to be a good daddy now. Whoa, 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 whoa! Super Miracle Sword! I'm gonna get you! Look at my Super Miracle Sword! What was I supposed to do? I already forgot. Oh, oh, dinner! Oh my god, I'm literally so stupid. Jeez. Dinner time! I knew that. It's that guy with the curly hair. I just saw him again. Yeah, he's in the that blue trunk. Probably spying on us again. It's definitely him. All right, I'll handle it. Make sure everyone gets inside. Uh-oh, more trouble. I'm gonna go take a look outside. Think you can handle dinner while I'm gone? Of course. Be careful, Uncle Kaz. If I'm not back in time for dinner, you guys can start without me. ruh -ro. Don't ruin my life in the orphanage, bitch. I am going outside to see what's up. I don't see anything! Oh, is the- is that the blue truck down there? No, that's like the same normal car as always. Mm. Uh. Oh. That's the same conversation. Okay. This is Daddy Simulator. Hey, I'm not mad about it. I think this is great. I'm learning a lot about parenting. Oh. Jeez! These women! Oh my god, they've been talking the same conversation for like three days. It's literally been, like, three days. I don't see him anywhere. Maybe Tai Chi was wrong? Did Tai Chi do that to get me out of the... Huh? <laughs> お礼の答えは変わってねえぞ。いや。今日はそういうんじゃねえんです。うん。じゃあ何の用だ。今日今日は兄貴にどうしても頼みたいことがあって。What kind of favor are we talking? It's got to do with the little lady. You mean the girl with the sketchbook? That's right. Two nights ago, she just disappeared. Nobody knows where she could have gone. You think she ran away? Don't know. We got men searching the streets and all, but they haven't found so much as a trace of her yet. And have you gone to the police? Well, not exactly. You should file a missing persons report. I don't know that we really can. 
Well, the truth of it is, she's the daughter of a guy the boss used to do business with. Now the boss is taking care of the girl, yeah? But he never officially adopted her. If the cops found out about that, they'd ship her back to her parents, no questions asked. And we don't want that? Right, Saki-san's parents are real scum of the earth, let me tell you. Her dad gambled all their money away, and then some, and then would come home stinking of, stinking of booze and beat the daylights out of the girl and her mom. Her mom, on the other hand, was always sleeping around, acting like she didn't want a damn thing to do with her. And then Nakahara took Saki in to protect her. Yep. Three years ago, we, could, we got asked to collect on her dad's gambling debt. So the boss went over to their house, and but when we, he walked inside, he found the guy dead. Hanging, blue-faced from a rope in the living room. Saki-san still clutching his lifeless leg. Oh. My. God. Probably off with one of her fuckboys. Lady never really, uh, never gave a single shit about Saki-san. Which is why Nakahara took her in. The boss looks scary, sure, but he's got a good heart. It just wasn't in him to leave Saki-san like that. And yeah, he complained at first about how much trouble it was raising a kid, but it wasn't long until he ended up a proud father. Now he treats Saki-chan like she's his own flesh and blood. But word has it that her mom's back in town that she wants to take Saki-san back. After all this time, why now? <sighs> Probably so she can have a maid do all the housework while she goes out and parties. Anyway, the boss has been trying to keep the little lady in the office so her mom wouldn't be able to find her. Which is why she was there when I stopped by. And now that she's missing, the boss is real worried. Saki's not a child anymore, though. Couldn't she just call him if she needed to? Call him? Not a chance in hell! The girl's mute! The doctor said it's some kind of mental block, probably from watching her dad hang himself right in front of her. So you see, she can't call us. And that's why she has a sketchbook. Come on, Anaki! We gotta find her as soon as possible, please! Oh my god, I can't imagine. I literally can't even imagine that. <laughs> が付けられねえ状態です。だから兄貴に出張ってもらって、とりあえず親父を落ち着かせてほしいんです。なんで俺なんだ。先日の一件から、親父は兄貴に一目置いてるみてえです。だからここは兄貴しか収められねえと。
I am walk shaming, yeah. Sorry, 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 sorry. Holy shit, you're strong. Wait, aren't you a former Yakuza? You got, I got a common squishy ball? say to that what the fuck stop beating me up i didn't do anything First time for that. Oh God, look at his neck. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh God, the things I'm doing to these people. I got top quality charcoal. Why the fuck do I want top quality charcoal? And why are you keeping top quality charcoal on, in your, like on in, on your being? What? Is that something that people just carry around casually? Ah, I almost got run over. I need to cross the street. I don't care. Uh, okay. No, okay, no. I'm trying to figure out where all the. Ah! Is this where I'm supposed to go? Am I in the wrong place? Oh, the oh my God! I'm I'm literally. <laughs> I'm having a hard time navigating in this game. <laughs> wow, this place is a wreck. Damn, bitch, you live like this? なんだよ。ああ。お。this time sorry but i'm not in the mood to talk about your little land problem rikia told me what's going on with saki that's rikia for you never knows when to keep his damn mouth shut this ain't your problem kiryu son why don't you go look for her can't wouldn't be so miserable if it was that easy what do you mean she ran away because she didn't want to live with me anymore i'd just scare her off if i was if i went hunting for her now you don't know that for sure why don't you try to figure out why she really ran away it wouldn't be too late to catch up to her if you go now. Rikia told me Saki's mom has been out looking for her recently. Maybe Saki just wanted to see her again after all this time. Same difference. Either she wants to be with her mom or she doesn't want to be with me. God damn it. Am I really worse than that miserable whore? Nakanara. I guess a Yakuza like me it doesn't have any business taking in a kid in the first place, huh? All children need is someone who really, truly cares about them. It doesn't matter what you do for a living. The hell do you know? You think you're some kind of kid expert just because you run a fucking orphanage? I know enough. I am I was an orphan myself. Not only that, the man who raised me was in the Yakuza. And since I have no memories of my birth parents, that man is more of a father to me than I've ever had. He might have been a Yakuza, yeah, but I loved him all the same. And I'm sure Saki loves you, too. But it's natural for her to miss her mom. She's still just a kid after all. You really think? 
Of course. Now get out of there. Get out there and find her before someone else does. Look at me, Kiryu-san. Why would Saki ever want to come back to this mess after seeing her mother? A thug like me could never compare to an actual parent. I'm just gonna have to face the facts. You really think so? Yeah, I do. Punch him. Punch him in the face. わかった。俺がさっきから話を聞いてやる。え Imagine just being a good person because you can be a good person. Find Saki. Thanks for talking to a manikey, but if we're really gonna look for Saki, I don't have the slimmest idea of where to start. And we'll just have to ask around. No! Uh. We don't know where the mom lives. Is there anywhere you haven't looked? Nowhere she'd be likely to turn up. Once only, only stone left unturned is Hatsumachi. Place is the biggest red light district on the island. Chock full of hostess clubs, brothels, all sorts of smut a kid's not gonna go anywhere near. Besides, it's Tamashiro family turf. Things would get real hairy real fast if we showed our faces over there. Then it's settled, we're going to Hatsumachi. I just told you! The only place you haven't looked. I don't care whose turf it is, we're going. Riki is now a Kiryu tier 3 sub! So it seems to be that way. You're welcome to stay behind if you think the Tamashiro are really that scary. Like hell that's gonna happen! I'm coming, Anarchy. Good, now let's go. Alright. Okay, so I need to go to this place. So, Hatsumashi... Hatsu... okay. I really... oh, the drugstore. I'm gonna keep that in mind. Tell me what's going on. It's Saki-chan. What about her? I saw her at Hatsumachi with some woman I've never seen before. Something felt real off about the whole thing. And you're sure it was her? Oh, well, if it isn't a dashing young fella from before, this must be fate. We don't got time for your hopeless flirt and let's try and focus. Where did you see Saki? Coming out of the convenience store over at the intersection with some woman who was absolutely dressed to the nines. I wonder who she was. Maybe Saki's mother. Then you really think she went back? Hard to say. The only way to know for sure is to find her and ask. Rikia, you gotta have a par you gonna have a party tonight? A party? Ah shit, it's the boss's birthday! I've been so distracted, it totally slipped my mind. It's not gonna be any uh, I'm he's not gonna be in any mood for celebration if we can't find Saki though. Then we're not doing ourselves any favors by standing around. Come on, let's go. We gotta bring her back, even if it's just for today. Let's move, Anarchy! Call me Anarchy one more fucking time, I swear. <laughs> she left on his birthday, I know! I do not care about 
Don't you her pathetic ass! Maybe she's trying to find a birthday present. That would be the wholesome ending, but I don't know if it's going to be wholesome or not. <laughs> we can hope, though. Who the fuck are you? Don't tell me you didn't know you're waddling all over Tamashiro family territory right now. Sorry, never heard of him. I usually try to keep my nose out of Yakuza business. Bullshit! It's clear as the damn Okino Okinawa sky what you do for a living. I'm telling the truth. And even if I was Yakuza, I'm not here looking for trouble. Now I suggest you leave us alone. Or else. Wait, is that Rikia back there? Your little game of hide and seek's not gonna work on me, Ryuto asshole. I knew it. Not Yakuza, my ass. If you were Yakuza, you wouldn't be spending your time with this Ryuto sap. You here to try and take the brat back? What brat? You don't got time for the 20... I don't got time for the 20 questions, bitch. Come on, boys, let's show them what we do to trespassers. Oh, my. Whoops. What am I doing? I gotta say, I love seeing all the blood on people. Is that bad? Is that weird? Everybody's so bloody, it's like kind of satisfying. Oh, I should probably... Can I upgrade mid-battle? That's awkward. Taunt! Something I never did in any of these fucking games. Wait, do I really not have enough? Aww. That's upsetting. Oh, dressed up in the nines? Oh, you guys are like discussing what that means? I mean, I would assume... I've heard it a couple times, but I assume it meant- I, I thought, like, dressing to the nines... Like, meant fancy? But I actually don't know. I don't remember the last time I heard that in context. I don't know. I don't know where it came from. Tell me about this brat you mentioned. You listening, punk? Open your mouth or I'll open it for you. Now, did you kidnap Saki or not? Look, we didn't take nobody. Some bitch clamming to be the girl's mother brought her in. What could her mom possibly have to do with Tamashiro? Duh, the tramp's sleeping with the boss! Probably doesn't realize she's gonna have a, she's another- she's just another notch on the bedpost for him. In other words, you have no reason to keep Saki. Give her back. We don't have her in a cage or nothing. She and her mom could be anywhere. I think there's more to this than you're letting on. Maybe we should go pay your boss a little visit. Rikia, where's the Tamashiro office? Are you out of your mind, Anaki? We gotta go. We can't just go in there, the two of us. Your boy's right. You're gonna get tear. They're they're gonna tear you limb for limb in there. But if you really want to die, I'll tell you. 
It's on the street behind the convenience store. You heard the man, Rikia. Come on. But anarchy. We're going. I should probably, like, heal before I go somewhere like this, right? That's, like, intelligent. <laughs> the white cure you always gets me. All right, what's this place? And how do I get in? Oh, it's a bar. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, a pool table. Oh God. Oh God. How drunk we getting tonight? Let's just get some old whiskey. Let's, you know, keep it very simple. This is another extremely popular Japanese whiskey. Yeah, give it to me. I like how drinking gives me experience. Oh god. <laughs> the controller vibrates annoyingly over the drunkenness. Alright, I'm not at full health, but it's whatever. Let's go and fight people. I mean, I can't be that bad at the game, right? Uh. What, you scared? Me? I'm not scared of a damn thing. I'd put my life on the line if you asked me to, Anakin. Wait, that's... Saki's sketchbook. Oh, no. We're definitely on the right track, Rikia. Uh, Saki has to be here. I want you to go get Nakahara and tell him that we found her. And bring him back with you. All right, looks like we're going. E -e -e. Oh, I'm sorry. Another one of Tamashiro's grunts, huh? Do I need to teach you a lesson too? Wait, please. Just look at me. Do I seem like a Yakuza to you? Yeah, you do. You have a point, <laughs> but you do look familiar. Anyway, if you're not with Tamashiro, what are you doing walking in their office? Well, I have a, a deal to make with them. You know how it is. I mean, you're obviously Yakuza. Not anymore, I'm not. I'm just here to take care of some business. Oh. I'm Kamiyama. What's your name? It's Kiryu. Kiryu-san, why does it feel like I know that name? Anyway, I deal in certain choice items. They've been in high demand la uh, lately, if I do say so myself. It sounds like the Tamashiro are going to war soon, so they asked me to bring some of my stuff over. And let me guess, by stuff, you mean weapons? You don't have to scream! The whole town's gonna hear! But if you're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Tamashiro, I might be able to lend a hand if you catch my drift. I thought they were the only- they were one of your customers. Well, yeah, but they're one of your- those customers you wish you could get rid of, but can't business- can't- can't because they pay your rent. Though if you started buying from me and wiped them out, I could finally be free from their clutches. Hold on a second. I never said a word about wiping anyone out. No need to be coy about it. I've been in this business for a long time. Rip guys like you on the bra uh, rip guys like you are the brawling type. It's obvious. You've probably been in more fights than I can count. He's not wrong. Either way, wouldn't you rather have a weapon on you when you bust in there? Better than that. Better that than going in empty-handed. I guess. All right, give me a weapon. Oh, geez, that is so shady. Not much for appearances! Okay, that is like the definition of shady, what the hell? Don't knock mobility, anything that can help you get away from the fuzz is a positive in my book. Near the Ryudo <laughs> office, okay. Wish I could give you everything you need to crush that Tamashiro, but running a- I remember I'm running a business here. Oh!
<laughs> All right, so you can also repair. So, so this. Movie props. <laughs> they kind of do look like movie props, I guess. Okay, so we got an extendable staff. This kind of sucks. Uh, so everything is the same inventory. Oh man, I got three worms in my inventory. Well, that's not good. Oh god, my inventory is full of shit! I need more sushi. Sorry, I'm getting more sushi. Eat the worm. I'm not gonna eat the worm. I can't even eat the worm! The game's not gonna let me! Like, if I even try to eat the worm, use item. See, I, like... <gasps> oh! My home! Cream. Fuck you. We're gonna die eating worms. I mean, I don't know why my health goes down. That's kind of bullshit if you ask me. Wait, why can't I go through here? This should be a shortcut. Why can't I go through here? No, I just want ice cream. Worms aren't poison. Yeah! Like, if you were stranded on an island and you had nothing to, uh, survive, and you ate a worm, you would live, right? You would live a little bit longer. Maybe, like, five seconds longer because you ate that worm. Give me ice cream. Oh, chocolate and vanilla. Oh, we can only get one. Sorry, I'm like a very basic bitch when it comes to ice cream. Most of the time I get chocolate or chocolate with like brownies in it, chocolate with chocolate chips in it. Me, very simple. You asked for a vanilla? I don't mind vanilla. But if I have a vanilla, I prefer to have a uh, French vanilla. French vanilla is better than vanilla bean for me. Escargot. Oh god. Oh, tenderloin steak. Oh. Oh. Oh, game, why? Hibachi, hee <laughs> hee hee. God, this makes me want to go to Hibachi like so fucking bad, dude. Strawberry is the best? Nah. I'm not a- I don't like any fruity flavors. I'm not, I don't like fruity flavored ice cream. Any fruity flavored ice cream. I haven't found one that I like. I don't know why. 
I just prefer to stick to chocolate or vanilla, but when it comes to fruity flavors, uh -uh. nope, nope. But then again, that's not very surprising because I don't like many fruits. I don't, I don't like strawberries. I am still drunk? Dang, this drunk meter takes a while to go away. I miss restaurants too. Dom and I were talking about that, like how bad we miss going to our like local diner. I miss going to diners, man. I miss it a lot. Right. Whoa! Going to the cinema for the popcorn. You can do that at home! Like, going to a restaurant, though, is is one thing I miss the most. I've been trying to, like, we try to order out sometimes to, like, try to help out the food industry, because they, uh, especially restaurant businesses. Oh, God, I don't like those men in the way they walk down the street. Okay, going around them. I don't want to fight. I should probably save. We haven't saved in a while. Oh, my God! Just leave me alone! Movie theater popcorn is better than homemade? That is not true. I actually make way better popcorn at home. See, the thing is, you can't you can't buy those like popcorn bags and you heat them up in the microwave and it pops in the microwave. No, that's not doing homemade popcorn. You can make way better popcorn at home, I promise you, than the movie theater. You gotta do it right. You know, the best way to do it is you buy the kernels you buy like a you buy the box of kernels. I love whenever Dom does this, and then you you put it on the stove top, put some oil, and then you you put it in a wok. The wok is a is a good way to make some homemade popcorn. But don't buy the stupid freaking bags of popcorn. No, I mean like we do buy them. I prefer them, but like if you really want like good homemade popcorn, I feel like every time we have it that way, it's really 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 good. I haven't saved in an hour and a half. Yikes. I really gotta save more often. Okay, please, nobody come beat me up randomly. I would like to move on with plot. Let's go. That guy's like heaving on the street and I really don't want to talk to him. I'm being a bitch. Person in pain that I could probably help? Nah, leave him. Leave him go. You do it, Kanetska. Saki wa doko da? Ano gaki no koto ga? Gaki nara oyabun no heya da. Daga, omae wa ano gaki ni au mae ni. <laughs> I miss Goro Majima. Sorry. Koyo. They're all color coordinated. They kind of 
bar. I didn't even realize that. Wow, that felt good. Items blocking your path will flash. Use your fists. Okay. I'm gonna punch some lockers down. Ah, there's a gun back there. Oh wait, no, that's not a gun. They're not throwing anything at me. I'll take that knife. Yeah, I do have a subreddit. I do. I need to advertise it more. Because I get, I still, I still get sent a lot of memes. And then I'm like, wait, but the memes should be posted on my Reddit. The Reddit's, mm -hmm. the Reddit's like the best place for memes to go. Oh God, I fucked up because I was talking about Reddit. <laughs> if you ever want to send me a meme that you make for the stream, just put it there. It's the magical place of Reddit. Magical. Hey, look. I'll be honest. I'm not. I'm not a Reddit user. But the only thing I do is look at my own subreddit. <laughs> That's all I do is look at my subreddit. Oh God, I can't walk. What happened to my bat? Oh, Jesus. I look at my Reddit page like every other day. Am I going the wrong way? Ah, fuck. No, I did it again! this hall. What the hell? Yeah, we got a home run! I have a sign and I'm going to carry it up the stairs. Oh, it's a bulletin board. Hello, I got your bulletin board. Take me down. Oh shit, wait, they did. 
Whoa, wait, they're actually fighting, kind of. Please stab here you get away with it. Oh My health is in danger. I should do something about it. And I should also upgrade. I was supposed to heal. Oops! I always forget something. Uh oh, we have a full inventory. It's time to eat sushi! さき。流動一家の新入りか。一人で飛び込んでくるとはいい度胸だ。俺は流動一家じゃない。その子を取り返しに来ただけだ。何おかしなこと言ってんだ。この崖に用があるのは中原だけだろうが。理由はどうでも
Oh no! Ow! How am I fighting through a table? What? Oh my god. This guy's annoying. But the kid just is staying there. Oh, I thought I... Oh, I accidentally... Okay. The kid's just standing there. Not even hiding. like garbo but what else is new that's what you get here garbage game gameplay those which is like really really bad Thing. Ah. Ow! That 
hurts my finger to press the R2 button actually that fast. The guys too remind you of Team Flare in Pokemon X and Y. I don't. I haven't played Pokemon X and Y, so I don't know. Maybe that's the look he's going for. Your finger feels numb after a while. Yeah, yeah. Saki. It's not very fun. なかはらの親さんな。お前がいなくなってすごく心配していたんだ。お前がな、本当の母親のとこに行っちゃったんじゃないかと思って、すごく寂しがっていたんだ。Why <laughs> Is she okay? Naniga Musumeo Naniga Hahoya yo Bakajana Nani Hatashuane Konokono said that Jesus and Mechakcha Natano Umaretakika. It's much a matata. このまま。お城の前で何てことうるさい。私に触らないで。わお。そんなにその子が欲しいなら、あんたにくれてやるわ。くそ。なんて親だ。実の子の。Then don't have a kid in the first place, you bitch. これじゃ先があんまりにも。さっきなら大丈夫だ。スケッチブックの中身見たことないだろう。ああ。見てみろ。いつも。答えは出ていたんだ。先はあんたの本当の娘なんだ。そうだろう、先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先。先
Whoa! What the fuck? Daigo. How did you find me? Daigo! Dude comes out of nowhere. リゾートの土地買収だと。ええ。実は今話題になっているリゾート開発に必要な土地の買収。沖縄の東上海傘下の組織は中心となって進めていたことなんです。なんだと。まさかその東上海傘下の組織ってのが玉城組だってのか。そ
後々警察にマークされてしまう可能性も高いそれだけは何としても避けたいと思い仲裁の役目を引き受けたわけですそういうことだったのかでもまさか桐生さんの施設が買収対象だったとは正直驚きましたよまあしかしこれでどっちにしてもあの土地を手放さなくてよくなったんだからよよかったじゃねえかまあなしかし今回はこういう結末になりましたがこのままというわけにはいきませんいずれリゾート計画は私の手で必ず実現させますどういうことだあんたは民谷の秘書だろうリゾートよりも基地拡大が重要なんじゃないのか私は沖縄出身ですこの辺境の地はこのままなら必ず廃れていってしまうリゾート開発計画のように直接沖縄に金が落ちる仕組みを作らなければこの島はいつまでたっても発展していかない私は民谷大臣の秘書ですが基地よりもむしろリゾートの方が沖縄には必要だと思っていますトーマさんしたっけかあんたはいあんた沖縄の人間なら分かってんだろう別に沖縄の人間がそんなこと望んじゃいねえってことくらいよ俺も最初は沖縄に金が欲しいならいいと思ったけどなやっぱりそうじゃねえ大事なのは俺ら沖縄の人間が愛せるままの沖縄ってことなんじゃねえのか一度東京に行けばわかりますよいかに沖縄が日本にとって必要のない小さな島なのかってことが私は何としても沖縄を豊かにしたいそのためなら多少の犠牲は必要だと思っていますその犠牲が俺らの土地ってわけかええ、沖縄には海や砂浜は腐るほどあります多少リゾートのために切り取ったところで問題はないはずだ目的のためなら一人二人の犠牲は構わねえだろうポリティクスの政治家さんの発想だと思うんだけどねでもよそんな土地に命張って生きてる人間もいるんだぜ I don't like it. とにかく今回の一件これで幕引きとさせてください失礼しようトーマ君はい大悟はいもしまた登場会がここの買収に来るようならその時は一言言ってから来てくれ俺にも守らなきゃならないものがあるからな分かっていますですがご安心ください。I like Daigo! 沖縄にあって出しません。I hope we get to see more Daigo action. ええ。俺は嫌ってほどキリュウさんの怖さ知ってます。敵に回したら登場会が潰れちまう。ふん。トーマ君の夢は彼が総理大臣になった時にでもやってもらいましょう。な、トーマ君。その頃はもう、キリュウさんもいい年になって、今面倒見てる子供さんたちも、今の俺くらいの年にはなってますよ。それならいいでしょう。俺は結構しぶといぜ。ふ<笑>、そうでした。じゃあ、今度はプライベートで、四代目。ああ。You want to be my third boyfriend? I know you're cool there. Hmm? Nanda. Anta, Mushka, stay. I know Tojo, kind of yon daime. Tewaki, jane, yona. So they got Osta. Eh? Uso, the row? Yon daime, stryo. Cotironing in the mysterious day. This guy's freaking out. Ah! Ah! Where are you? I shot this day. Kill you! That's you! Oh my god, bro! 
ちゃんと相手のことを調べてからにするんだな兄弟<笑>なんかとんでもねえやつと坂月かわししまったぜ<笑> The biggest fish in the Yakuza Sea, hey, it me, Kiryu. <laughs> Bro, big fan, no way! <sighs> That's you, the dragon! Aw, that was a cute face that he had. Save data, yes! That's so cute. When people realize who Kiryu is, and he's so, like, notorious. So people's reactions to him are, like, super, super cute. One year later. Wow, that's a time skip. Oh, we're back to the present with the Cosmo thing. Oh, right, 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 right. Hi, Kiryu. What is that? Kashiwagi. Kashiwagi. Kashiwagi-san, sorry. I'm just now at the hospital. Can I ask you to come back later? Kiryu, the six years old was shot. What? Daigo! Daigo will be fine. What do you mean? 1時間くらい前に本部の会長室で撃たれた詳しいことはまだわかん I believe Daigo is always you know Daigo is gonna be fine 話によると6代目を撃った男は風間の親父そっくりだったらしいえ風間の親父さんにああそうらしいんだ風間 literally died in Kiryu's arms and he knows it This guy is a doppelganger, or he like had facial surgery to make him look like Kazuma. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Oh, that was crazy. Oh, that was crazy. その絵の男なんですかああそうらしいんだ Not him Doc, how's the boss? We've done all we can to stabilize his condition The next week or so will be critical Is he gonna make it? It's hard to say with absolute certainty. He was shot three times at point-blank range, after all. Luckily, the bullets all appear to have narrowly missed his vital organs. That is certainly something to be thankful for. What are the odds he'll pull through, Doc? You gotta tell me. At the moment, I'd say around 50-50. But remember, he managed to call an ambulance entirely on his own despite having been shot multiple times. I don't think he's ready to leave you all just yet. And we'll do everything we can to make sure he doesn't. Oh, boy. Kodomo tachi wa? Zenin, neta mitai. Uncle Kaz? What's up, Haruka? Are you gonna go back to Kamurocho? I don't know if I am. I have a life here now. Responsibilities. I don't have time to go running off to Tokyo at the drop of a hat. But if you don't, we're gonna lose the orphanage, right? It's hard to say. Though one thing's for sure, whoever shot Nakahara was after the deed for our land. Riki, a little late. Sorry, but I've got a favor to ask. Well, uh, I want to go to Kamurocho with you. I know you're going to try and get the deed back, Aniki, which means finding the guy who shot the boss. Please, you've got to take me with you. 
Oh, and Mikio can stick around the hospital while we're gone. He's on board if it means getting us back for what that asshole did to that boss. And Saki, what happened to her? Uh... Look, I'm glad you want to get revenge for your boss, but who's going to be there to look after Saki if you're not around? No. I can do it! Saki-chan can stay with us at the orphanage. It's not going to be easy, you know. I know, but she's probably been lonely with her dad in the hospital and everything. Maybe it'll be good for her to spend time with other kids for once. I'm sure the others would love to have a new friend to play with. Please, Uncle Kaz, I've trusted you all these years. This time I need you to trust me. We'll take good care of her, really. Aww. Aniki, だから。だから俺を連れて行っはい。Look at the sky. Damn, is it beautiful. Haruka. Rikia no koto mo tanunda. Eh? Aitsu wa koko ni oite iku. Ima no Kamuro chou wa kiken sugiru. Aitsu wo tsurete iku wake ni wa ikanai. Oji-san. Aww. It's getting kind of chilly. Let's go in, Uncle Cass. I guess there's a lot on my mind, but you don't need to wait for me, Uncle Kaz. You have a big trip tomorrow. Uh, we did just save, so... Yeah, let's go. <laughs> this game is sad. But, like, in a weird way. Wholesome, heartwarming, we get to see Daddy Kiryu. But now we leave the kids behind. But now we have a pet dog? You're gonna get it this time, you stupid mutt! Zumi, this dog a friend of yours? <laughs> You're not getting away that easy! Oh shit, I know where that dog's from! Language Mikio. Now tell me about this dog. He used to live over at Izakaya in Hatsumachi. Quite a little fella back then, not the maniac he is now. Honestly, he's so out of his mind I didn't even recognize him at first, but he's definitely the same dog. <laughs> The guy who ran that place shipped on a, a ship, shipped on up to Tokyo a while ago, though. Guess he just abandoned the dog. Hey, didn't you used to have a dog of, on your, of your own, Izumi-chan? Can I go look for the dog, Uncle Kaz, please? I'm sure he'll come yeah. back eventually. No, I'm gonna go find him! Alright, you want a hand? Yes, please! Oh god, we're finding a dog now, okay. He got away. Now that's the fastest dog I've ever seen. You're just slow, Tai Chi. I totally could have caught him. Oh yeah? Then why didn't you? That's enough, you two. Where'd the dog go? He's running off toward town. Looks like we're gonna have a little, gonna have a little field trip then. Alright, we're going after the <sighs> pupper. Ugh. <sighs> Nanda 
I told you, we don't want any ice cream. Uncle Kaz is gonna say the same thing. Yeah. Damn it, kid. You're not listening to words coming out of my mouth. I need to see a guy named Kazuma Kiryu. Are you Kazuma Kiryu? What do you want to do with my kids? I don't appreciate people pe pressuring them to buy ice cream. Kazuma Kiryu, I have come for you. Now, yeah, that's right. I know you know Kamiyama. Domo, domo. I trained Kamiyama in the use of a bunch of weapons, he's, he, he, weapons he carries. I'm kind of a master at him. I weapons master, you might say. Name's Yanashiro. Yonashiro. Kamiyama told me all about how you were looking for new and exciting ways to bust stalls, so here I am. Why would a master come all the way? All this way at the rest of his pupil. Okay, okay, you're, you're a little suspicious, understandable, but I'm not a rich dude. I spend most of my time selling ice cream on the beach. Kamiyama is my pupil, but he also sells me weapons at a discount because I'm such a great guy. I'm basically, and, and because I'm such a great guy, I can't refuse him when he asks me to do something. Alrighty, learn from him. Time to get trained. Time to get good at the video game. Such a great guy, yeah. Fuck your training. Anyway, I really should do it, though. I'll do it later. My hand movements? Wait, what do I do with my hands? No, 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 <laughs> Property damage. Yeah, I don't know why we break down a random window of a place and, and then I just like feel bad about it, you know? Get up off the ground and fight me like a like a maid. Mr. Flower Shirt? Oh, Jesus, that looked like it hurt so bad. Thanks for the platinum nail. You know what I need is that freaking pawn shop. Ah, fuck. All right, we're gonna try and find the pawn shop. I think I found it before. Holy shit, that's a sub story. I hope it doesn't trigger. I'm just gonna let it... Okay, that guy is just gonna stay fucked. Looks like you're in a bit of a pickle over there. Look at this guy. Well, all right, time to just keep <laughs> keep doing my little thing. <laughs> God, this game makes me feel like such an asshole sometimes. He's just gonna stay on the bridge forever. Exactly. You know, one day I'm sure he'll be fine. Where is uh, the pawn shop? Oh wait, upgrades. Don't come near me! Okay. Map. Uh. List. I need the pawn shop. Where are you? Oh! Right there! I passed it! Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. Am I at. Uh, oh, it's this store. Oops! I'm supposed to be chasing down a dog or something, and then I would- <laughs> And I don't know what I'm doing with my life anymore. 
Okay, so I have a golden plate. Some top quality charcoal. I don't know what to do with this. You could use a hammer and nail with this dense piece of charcoal. That's great. I knew it too. Yay! Money! Oh, I could do karaoke. You are right! Instead of finding a dog. Anyway, Hatsumachi, I'm supposed to go back there. So we're gonna go. As long as nobody stops us along the way. Oh, look, it's a turtle! <laughs> what is this guy doing? <laughs> it looked like he wanted to fight me and then he just like turned away. Okay, the dog's supposed to be somewhere down here. I hope I'm in the right spot. Mm -hmm. No! Fuck off! Ice cream sounds so good, dude. You wanna know what I did on Sunday? As like a, I guess a mini treat to myself in a way. I, we ordered Dairy Queen. I've never had Dairy Queen delivered before, but I did it and uh, I did not regret it in the slightest. It was fucking amazing. Yeah, Dairy Queen. Oh, you don't have Dairy Queen? It's okay, it's not the best ice cream place. It's just one that was open. I wanted to go to Baskin Robbins. Oh, that's what we actually wanted. I wanted a polar pizza from Baskin Robbins and they actually didn't have the polar pizza. So I was really depressed and I didn't know what to do. So I was like, I really want ice cream. So if I can't get a polar pizza from Baskin Robbins, then I guess I'll just settle for some Dairy Queen ice cream. So yeah, I was, I was trying to buy a polar pizza. This, I'm in, I'm in Hatsumachi, yes. This is Hatsumachi. I'm supposed to be looking for the dog here, somewhere. Hey, have you seen a dog? Oh, cabaret club. I should go to that. I'm in the right, okay, I'm in Hatsumachi. Just need to find the dog. Dog -o, dog o dog o dog o dog I'm not very good at looking for things, so this might not work out well for me. Is this tech- oh, this is Kabuchi. Okay, this is not the right place, so this is too far. A literal pizza? No, 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 it's a polar pizza. Just Google polar pizza. <laughs> Just Google it. That's the best advice I can give you. Are you okay, kid? Oh, that's the kid I beat up before. Fuck you. Dude, yes, polar pizzas are amazing. Oh, it's the dog! We found it! Don't worry, boy, I'm not gonna hurt you. Oh, and there he goes running. Running, running, and hold R2 to dash. Don't let the dog out of your sight. But wait, there was a... Oh, come on, bro. There was a shiny thing. Wait, is that a wind sound effect? Whenever we dash, we hear the wind blow through our ears. Really? Oh, that is fucking hilarious. Wind dot MP3, yeah, it'd be MP3. That's fucking funny. Man is new, man. What do you expect? I mean, when I run, I don't hear the wind blow through my ears. Maybe in the car, but like, what? What's it get? Can we keep him? We didn't keep him. The thing's terrified of you guys. Can't you see why you 
Can't see why you'd want him anyway. Well, I do want him because... Oh. That's the dog my mommy and daddy got me whenever I was born. Mm. When this doggy showed up near our house, I thought for a sec that Mame came to see me. Mommy. Can we keep him, Uncle Cass, please? Okay, but only if you train him to not be so crazy. Come on, Izumi-chan. That dog's never gonna be normal. Everyone's afraid of new things. Dogs and people alike. But if you show him that you're scared, he'll be scared too. So you just have to put on a brave face, understand? Aww. Dad, oh, Dad Kiryu over here still giving the best dad advice. Dog food? I have to go buy dog food now. Are you fucking kidding me? No. What is this? Yakuza 1? Uh, fuck. I remember seeing that before, too. I remember seeing dog food that I could buy at the store, and I was like, hmm, I wonder if I should buy that for a future thing. The dog is gonna summon a persona any minute now, yes, probably. Okay. You know what? I wouldn't even be- I, I wouldn't even be the bride anymore. Alright, milk, umbrella, lighter fluid, patented hanger, catnip stick. You have catnip sticks, but you don't have dog food. Okay, I was gonna say, where's the fucking dog food? I hate that I'm already hungry. It's only three o'clock. I mean, I could go grab chips and have a snack, but fuck that. I can't dash anymore. Dang. I just got dog food. Wait, what do you- Did I not buy the dog food? What happened? I- uh, what, am I going crazy? I definitely bought the fucking dog food or what? It's not even in my inventory. I'm going crazy. Oh my god. I bought it. I know I did. You guys watched me buy it. No? Yes, I must you never saw you select the dog food? I did. And I even said check out. It was 900 yen. Wait. I bought something that was 900 yen. What did I buy? Oh, I didn't buy the right thing. What the fuck, dude? Whatever. Alright, look, I'm a bimbo sometimes. He's not eating it. Oh, I have a squishy ball. I have a ball, a ball, a ball. Now to find a ball. No, I have one. I have, I have a ball. I have a ball. No, how is mine not good enough? I have a, a squishy ball right here. My squishy ball isn't enough. Like, a dog would love a squishy ball. No? I've never- I've never had a dog. But wouldn't they like it because then they can bite down on it? No? Maybe they need a tough ball or something. 
but it's for kids. What? Who said a squishy ball had to be for kids? I'm supposed to be looking for a kid or something? Koji has one back at the orphanage. Okay, Koji! Who the fuck is Koji? Are you Koji? I forget. Oh, hey, you are Koji. Found you. I borrowed a rubber ball. Borrowed? We didn't borrow it. It definitely, like, it's getting ruined. If you're giving a rubber ball to a dog, you're not getting that ball back. You're allergic to dogs! See, Dom is allergic to cats and it makes me sad because I desperately want a cat. I... Uh, I miss... I miss not having... I miss having a cat because I've had a cat for like the past 15 years of my life and then not having a cat is so weird and I hate it. I want a cat. But he's allergic and on top of being allergic he has asthma so it's not like he can just like suffer through it like people have been saying like just get a cat anyway I'm allergic to it but I just get it. But no, he has asthma, so like, I don't want Dom to die. <laughs> Krista Fields was my top emote of 2020, let it be not. Wait, really, Prophet? Are you for real? Please tell me that you're joking. Why would you use the feels emote so much? Why? This feels like ultimate betrayal. That's like Twitch's worst emote. I have it. No, no, no. Feels is not the top emote. It, he's saying that he uses it the most. Ask me no questions and I'll tell you no lies. What? Prophet, please! What the fuck, dude? Oh, you kill me. But hey, thanks for the 26 months. I hope that the 26 months of having Krista feels makes you happy or something? I don't know. I almost got run over my car, oh my god! Oh. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm supposed to walk around town or something, but... That is exactly what I'm doing. I'm walking around town. That is not true. Hypoallergenic cats don't exist. We asked a doctor about that. And they don't really exist. It's a fucking lie. <laughs> Hey man, what's up? Hmm? Ah. Oh. Bum, bum, bum. You aggressively get run over by cars in this game, but I hate it. Aww. <laughs> Yeah, it's very alarming. Oh god, where did- I don't know what I just found. Oh, the- the- oh, the guy told me that this place existed. Oh, I'm dumb. I should find the coin lockers here, too. <laughs> Modding? My apologize to cats, aka a dog. Yeah. Because the thing is, you can be allergic to two different things. You can be allergic to the dander, or you could be allergic to the saliva of a cat. There's two different allergies. So if you're allergic to the saliva, there's literally no such thing as a hypoallergenic cat. Because <laughs> you, you, can't, you can't get rid of that. Like, what are you going to do? <laughs> what can you do about that? What if I just never use weapons in this game? 
Like, actually, let's buy buy equipment. So these are, wait, quiz, a collection of quiz shows from TV? What the hell? A collapsible hammer. That actually sounds dope, let's buy it for no reason whatsoever. Don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. <laughs> All right, we gotta go back and see what's up. Sounds good. The view is a view from up here. How do I get down? Oh God, where's the stairs? Where's the stairs? Where's the, uh, stairs, stairs, stairs. How did I get up here? Stairs, oh, I found them. I love that little jingle. <laughs> Ryder, you have no idea the stupid shit that I do in real life. I, um, I do a lot of stupid shit, yep. Yeah. I don't want to get into it. I, I would do something like that, though. the way, this store is Tamashiro property now. Scram! Quit your fucking yapping. Come on, let's teach that mud a lesson. Meh. Wait, you want me to tell you, like, the stupid shit that I do? Um, that's okay. Go get him, doggo! Oh. Good dog! Good dog! Oh, OP dog! Oh my god! OP dog! Holy shit! Oh, shit. 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 Oh, だいじょうか。あ、豆、豆は。おお。ほほほほ。やったな。豆。犬小屋か。でも俺一度大工目指してくじけたんだよな。<笑> Oh, it's so cute! Oh, I don't have any- I don't- I'm too lazy to get up off my ass for chips, so I'm just gonna have a Tootsie Roll instead, since I have Tootsie Rolls. I still have this giant ass bag of candy I showed you guys like weeks ago. It hasn't even- it, there's not even a dent in it. I swear to god. That candy will never die. Oh! in the street. So many turtles in one place.
I know. You said you were going to be shipping up to Kamurocho tonight, but I realized we never agreed on a time. Figured I'd stop by and check with you. Oh, God. Awkward. Uh, the flight will be at 8 o'clock, I guess. Shouldn't you have booked that by now? Hey, that's pretty late. We're not going to get into Tokyo till 11. That's fine. Kamurocho never sleeps after all. Oh, I'm packed up and ready to go. This trip's going to be great. We're not going to have fun, Rikia. This is all business. Yeah, yeah, I know. Anyways, we got some time till we gotta head out for the 8 o'clock flight. Guess I'll just chill here for now. Right, uh, good idea. Take a gander over there. Mitsuo and Renoa, what about them? Someone's got a mean case of young love, if you catch me. I'm not sure I do catch you. Just watch, yeah? Hey, Riona! You know Okada from school? His dad's, like, mega rich. Apparently he owns three whole movie theaters in town. Did you know that? <clears throat> oh, well, anyway, me and Okada were talking, and he gave me these two free tickets for a movie at one of his dad's theaters. Are you sure you didn't beat the tickets out of him? What? Of course not! Yeah, sure. Anyway, it turns out those tickets are only good until today. Can you believe it? I'm out of luck if I don't go now. What should I do? Um, just go? Well, I wanna, but none of my friends can do it today. Huh, can't you just go alone then? But, Riona! <laughs> Will you go with me? Sorry, I have plans. What? What kind of plans? Don't you have a movie to get to? Maybe Shiro or one of the other guys would wanna go. Um, yeah. Oh, ouch, that rejection. Yikes. Young love is tough. Ouchie wouchie, that gotta hurt. Not surprising with those clothes, though. Not sure you're one to be critiquing fashion, Rikio. <laughs> oh, come on, just look at this luscious hair. Not a single strand out of place. Yeah, it looks practically like a wig. Yeah, because it's one solid block. <laughs> Hold up, Anakin. Do you not like how I look? And whatever, guess you're just behind the times. Excuse me? You gotta accept that fashion ch fashions change, old timer. I know more about fashion than you do. Sure you do, Anakin. Hey, why don't we have a little friendly contest? You know, see who's really got the best taste. A fashion contest, huh? Oh god. Is this for real? You're gonna regret this. I'm gonna make you regret challenging me, Rikia. Sure you are, Anaki. Sure you are. All right, here comes the rules. Each of us is gonna pick out some stuff to really make Mitsuo's style pop. One clothing item, one accessory. Got it? Good. Then let's regroup back here when we've got the when we've got them. I'm gonna whoop your ass to high heaven, Anaki. Why are we having a fashion contest? Okay. How do I end up agreeing to these absurd requests? I do want to help Mitsuo, though. I guess I'll play along. Yeah, I think we all need the reminder that this is a... This is a, uh, crime drama. A very serious crime drama. You and that flowery man, Rikia-kun, was it? You wanna- you wanna make Mat mitsuo kun more popular with the ladies, yeah? Yeah, uh, I honestly don't know a whole lot about the latest trends, though. I was just kinda window shop- I was just gonna window shop a bit downtown. In that case, I'd recommend shopping in the store right near the big intersection. I've never actually stepped foot in the place myself, but one of the resident neighborhood housewives seemed very keen on their products. Yo, thanks for the tip. Let's fucking go! This is a dad simulator. Hey, I'm living for it. Okay, Kiryu needs this. We've had three games of brutality with Kiryu, and he needs a break, you know? This is this is a nice change of pace for him. Oh god, please don't run me over. Yes, yes, yes. Pick a dragon print polo. Why would you buy an American flag polo? No one in their fucking right mind would want that. 
Only two options, I guess. Guess I'll go with- I guess you would buy that- I've seen people buy that for, like, July 4th parades, but that's still, like, cr still cringe. Okay, maybe it's not cringe. It's aight. Uh, a 10-gallon hat? Sunglasses. Sunglasses are, like, pretty cool, yeah? But a 10-gallon hat? Why the fuck- what? Sunglasses. I'll go with the sunglasses. Not much cooler than that. Very good, sir. 2,000 yen. Okay, perfect. Imagine wearing a dragon polo with sunglasses. We are gonna be so fucking stylish. Oh, come on! Ow! Hey! with that <laughs> fucking punk ow cowboy hat yes yeah 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 it's like one of those um like wide wide rim tall with like a, a bucket almost I don't know what to call the indent in the hat. Why can't I dash? They let you dash to chase the dog, but then you don't keep the dash. I just want to go home! Leave me alone! Oh Jesus, oh Jesus. Oh my god, it's so- ah! Give me this bike! And fuck you! Yes, Japan is exactly 200% exactly like this game. This, I mean, Yakuza could also be called a a Japan simulator. It, it basically is a Japan simulator. That's the alternate name for the Yakuza series. All right, I'm ready for a fashion beatdown. What am I doing in this game? You'll feel better soon, Mitsuo. We're gonna give you a fashion makeover. Whoa, really? Heck yeah, you're gonna have to claw the ladies off you, and it'll be all thanks to me and my amazing taste. Uh. I don't know about this. All right, we're starting with mine. The kid's gonna be too shy to look in a damn mirror if you dress him up like that. What? other options. Don't you want to look cool? 
Yeah, that's why I'm not taking your clothes. Nobody wears stuff like that anymore. And besides, why would I wear your junior high clothes? And I'm still in elementary school. I'd rather take things the things Uncle Kaz picked out. Eh, who's behind the times now, Riki? I haven't seen clothes like that in years. Not like you did any better. Don't be like that. You lost fair and square to me, an old timer. Why don't you go get changed, Mitsuo? Oh, God. Dude, look at this kid! Yo, you look fly! What do you mean? He said this doesn't feel cool? Bro, look at this kid! You look like a Yakuza in training. I don't think it's that bad. And hey, doesn't the dragon print make you feel closer to your Uncle Kaz? It's always dragons with you, Aniki. Alright, Mitsuo, get over there and show Reno what you've got. I bet you this is gonna work. I couldn't find anyone else who wanted to go to the movie with me, so are you sure you don't want to come? Uh, what are you wearing? I wouldn't be caught dead in a movie theater with a guy dressed like that. Anyway, I already said I have plans. I thought the kid looked cool, but whatever. Whatever, game! You don't even know if he likes her. You can't ignore how you feel, Mitsuo. Huh? You like her, right? Yeah, I really like her. Then you know what you need to do. You're right, I'm not gonna give up. Anyway, I should go grab Taichi. He said he's, he'd see the movie with me if Renoa didn't want to go. I can't believe... Yeah, I, I think I've... I think I can say that everybody just has bad taste in this game. Because that looks fly as fuck. And now we're going back into town. Okay. Okay, never mind, we're not going back into town. You know where Haruka-chan is? I need to talk to her. Probably out shopping for groceries if she's not home. Huh? But I need her now! I'm gonna go hang out with some friends from school, so I was trying to make a bento. But I can't figure out how to make Dirawakashi. Oh, I know the mash- you know, the mash- the mashed taro with pork? I've definitely seen Haruka-chan make it before, but I can't find her anywhere. Do you know how to make it, Uncle Kaz? Teach me! Okay. Yeah, Renoa does have bad taste. I mean, look at her shorts with her shirt right now. I think that is... It... Humph! Yeah, we're trashing kids' clothes. Yeah, we are. Yeah. Mm. It's not gonna be just us. Oh, they're going on a date. Is it with Mitsuo? Uh -huh. What? No! I think you two would be good together. I know he's kind of immature sometimes, but you'd be happy with him, Rinoa chan Look, it's not gonna happen, Haruka-chan. I just can't see myself dating a black guy. Whoa! Holy shit! Renoa chan Sorry, that came out wrong. Anyway, I have to go. Oh my god! Sounds like she doesn't like Mitsuo because he's different. That's not how I raised her. That's right, Kiryu! You put that foot down, and you're like, no, 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 no. Not in my house, bitch. Not in my house. Aren't you supposed to be at the movies with Mitsuo? 
I was gonna go, but then he told me it was some gross love story. I don't want to see that with him. And where is he now? I don't know. I just kind of walked off. He didn't look too happy. Do you remember which direction he went in? Pretty sure it was over towards downtown. Oh, I bet he's gonna go see that movie by himself. Sounds like I should check up on him. Wow. That came out of fucking left field, man. Holy shit. Dang! These kids are all over the place and I'm leaving tonight or something. Where am I going again? Uh, we're going after him, but I don't know where the movies are. They're not on the beach, are they? Hey, there's something on the beach. An old suspension. What is that? Oh. Why do I have that? I don't know where the movies are, but I'm going downtown. We're gonna find out where they are somehow. Uh... Um... Oh gosh... Uh... There's no movies. Oh no... Oh no, how do I go after a kid if I don't know where he's at? I love Kiryu's power jog. Me too. It's great. Hi, do you know where the movies are? These kids are all over the place. Back off, punk! Hey! Did- Oh! I'm sorry! I didn't actually mean- Okay, uh, I'm so sorry! I just want to know where the fucking movie theater is! I don't know! Oh my god! I'm sorry! I always feel bad when I knock people over in these games. Uh. Oh, do you? Crap, no. <laughs> you killed him. I did not kill him. I, I did not. Oh. Wait, no, leave me alone. I, I just want to pick up this shiny thing on the ground that bugged me from before. I couldn't pick it up because of the stupid dog cutscene. Leave me alone, buddy. Whoa. Okay, I, I literally have no idea where I'm going. Uh, Mitsuo went off to a movie theater that I don't know where it exists. Wait, let me look again. Maybe... But still went to see a movie by himself. Sounds like he was pretty let down. I should go after him. Okay. And then we look at the list of places. I'm not going crazy, am I? Like, I'm, I don't, I'm not just, like, passing it up. These are all stores. Then you have Mahjong, Karaoke, Shogi, which is the only, like, amusement places. Cabaret club. He wouldn't go to a cabaret club. I'm going to the cabaret club, though. Oh, wait. This isn't the cabaret club. Um, It's the one up here. Sorry, turtles. 
Wait, I'm going the wrong way. Fuck. Oh, God, I get lost so easily. Time to check every building. No. I want to go up those stairs. Never mind. I guess we're not going to. Flawless. Okay. Cabaret club. Why am I going here? I don't know. いらっしゃいませ. A specific hostess? Mika! I don't know who any of them are, but we're about to find out. Oh, hello! I like the flower in your hair. Let's have some fun. Sounds good to me. Uh, oh god. I'll take, uh... I think I'll just take a good old beer. She'll look down on me. Oh god. Let's take this, at least. No, what? No, okay. Uh, I... That one. It's kind of surprising. Would you like to eat something? Uh, sure. I will take some good old chocolate. You can't go wrong with chocolate. I'm surprised you can stomach that. Hold on, I'll order it. What? It's just chocolate. What do you mean? What does that even mean? Can you, how can you stomach chocolate? It's chocolate! Dozo. It took away my half heart I had. Kanpai. Hi, dozo. You're from Tokyo, right? In a broad sense, yeah? Cool, I'm actually from Tokyo too. Really? What part? I used to live in Narima. I grew up in Kanagawa where my family lives, but I moved to the city for work. I certainly spent more than a few evenings li living, uh, living, living it up in Kamurocho. Is that so? Eh. Kamurocho's great. There's always something new and exciting to do no matter the time of day. The city never sleeps. You're right about that. You miss Tokyo. How'd you end up in Okinawa? Everyone asks me that. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I like to tell people that I was completely enchanted by the warm tropical sun and the beautiful clear ocean. I just couldn't leave them behind. Not too hard to believe. Have you had any trouble understanding the words and phrases they use here in Okinawa? A little, yeah. The people here have all sorts of words and phrases that I couldn't even start to understand. For example, they refer to themselves in mainlanders totally differently. Take Shimanchu and Uchinanchu, for example. I knew Shima meant island, but the rest completely bewildered me. The first time I heard someone refer to themselves that way, I was completely lost. Yeah, I was definitely confused by that at first. They call trash cans Chirabako instead of Gomibako. Dust cans instead of trash cans. I think that's really cute. I think I thought of another thing. In Tokyo and pretty much everywhere else, when you leave work, you kind of half apologize for not being the last one to leave, right? But here in Okinawa, they're, they aren't formal about it at all. They pretty much just say, Okay, I'm out of here, bye! That's pretty drastic difference, yeah. I've really taken an interest into the little language differences between here and the mainland. I can tell you some more if you like. I would love to hear more. <laughs> One thing you'll have to do for me. What's that? You have to tell me more about yourself, Kiryu-san. Uh. Oh, we have to wrap things up, but I only got three quarters of a heart. I got her business card. Ooh. Here's my bill. Oh god, I'm gonna be broke. Cabaret clubs are expensive.
Oh! Thank you for requesting me today. Isn't Okinawa wonderful? I hope you have lots of fun here in Okinawa, Kiryu-san. Oh, she texts me now. Guess we're on a texting basis now. All right, so Mitsuo is, uh, I'm very confused. Maybe he's not downtown at all. Maybe I have to go back. Huh? I'm going back. Maybe he never left. It, it, it just like implies that he already went to the movie theater. So he wouldn't be here. I mean, there's not many places to look. We did look on the beach though, right? So he's not hanging out at the beach. Oh, look, another thing washed up. One of these times, something cool is gonna wash up to shore. A worm. Okay. Mitsuo! Hey, doggo! Do you know where the kid is? God dang it. Yeah, boxed worm. Makes perfect sense. Don't question it. <laughs> hey, I think it's really exciting that a worm can get washed up to shore, okay? Jay, you just don't understand. Also, I can get some health. They said I can recover health in my hideout. I'm gonna see how that works. Haruka has a trust level. Well, fuck your trust level! Yeah, I don't know how the worm didn't drown. The worm- if- if the worm is in a box and got washed up on shore, that worm would be so dead. I mean... A fish would go for a dead worm on a fishing hook, too. It doesn't need to be alive, I suppose. Alright, is Mitsuo, like, back here? What's in this box? Oh, coin locker. How the fuck did that get there? What? How do I get to the... Oh, there we go. I gotta go this way. I don't ask why there's a thing in the- why there's a coin locker key. I, you know what? Those are some of those things in video games that you just don't question because you're just- the, the, the placements for the coin locker keys are in such random spots. Don't question it. Okay, so Mitsuo is definitely downtown somewhere. And there is no, like, movie theater per se? Like, I can only think of karaoke, but that karaoke is not exactly the movie theater.
Yeah, because of three. Don't question. More like any video game. You could say that about a lot of video games. There's a lot of, like, things that you just don't, absolutely shouldn't question. I also should probably try to spend time finding... I haven't found the coin lockers yet, either. There's a lot of really weird stores back here that I've never explored. Hello? No. Follow me if you're interested, fishy old man chat. Do we go with him? I mean, what's the worst that can happen? I can just beat him up. Um... <laughs> Let's go! What is this place? Uh. Oh, a gambling hall! Oh, thanks! Not too bad. Thanks, dude. Now, can you show me where the fucking movie theater is? So now we know that this is a gambling hall. There's so many little shops and stuff. I can go down here. There's so much to explore! All these cute shops. But no fucking movie theater! Can I not go down there? Oh, I can't. Okay. Oh, this place back here is super cute. I kind of want to stay back here. Get out of my way! Okay. All the time now seems like a godsend. I know. I gotta just, like, fucking guess where I'm supposed to go right now. Sometimes they tell you. But yeah, other times- Oh, come on, dude! No! Other times they just don't tell you. Ow. <laughs> Get up! Fight me like a man! Oh! Oh, and I just... Oh. Thank you! Yikes! Oh, hey! Shiny! Everyone's cheering for me? I know! It's really kind! So up those stairs is the weapons place. That is the, uh, the the family. I forget that family's name already. Maybe I just go in every store. Hi, are you a movie theater? I swear to God, if I passed it like a million times already, I will cry. What, you know what? If I just like look down the main street, what looks like a movie theater? Oh Jesus, that's a car. <laughs> Oh my god! That's Smile Burger! Nothing looks like a movie theater here. <laughs> I'm crossing! No! Oh my god! Oh, let me find the movie theater, you fuck! <laughs> I do not want any of your bullshit right now. Please. Throw him into moving cars? That is so savage. But actually, that would be kind of cool if I could do that. I'm all red and shit. Whoa! 
Ew, look at the blood down the neck in the sh- Ew. <laughs> this game is a lot more bloody. Oh, and I broke his glasses. Oh, that's unfortunate. I'm sorry, dude. Okay, movie theater, movie theater. Okay, just use your eyeballs, Crystal. Use the eyeballs. This... Uh, maybe, maybe in this, like, little... You know, it, a, pl a place can look like a movie theater, right? So I just have to look for something that looks like a movie theater. This does not look like a movie theater. That guy is still there. Um, and I'm still not gonna do anything about it. Feels bad, man. Uh... Movie theater, oh. movie theater. No! I just want to move on with my fucking plot! Alright, chat, after this battle, uh, you are allowed to tell me where the- where the fuck I'm supposed to go right now. Also, my health! Thanks for the money, dude! Okay, uh, we didn't really look at all the buildings over here, I think. This is karaoke. The southeastern part, all the way over there? Wait, like, where we were before? What? I didn't think it'd be over there. Okay, here's the answer. Okay. Also, I don't know where the coin lockers are. I haven't found those either. Alright, I'm making my way. I could have taken the taxi. I probably should have taken the taxi. That's it? Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. <laughs> okay. Don't hit me! Crossing the street. Okay. There he is! Are you kidding me? I just had to walk over here. It's the only place on the map I didn't walk to. Uh, I'll go anywhere as long as you're with me. My dad has a pretty close uh, hotel pretty close here with a big pool. Maybe we can go for a swim. Oh wow, that sounds amazing, Okada-kun. Heck yeah, I've never been to a hotel pool before. Something wrong, we know it, Chan. Uh, it's nothing. Oh yeah, Riona has that gross burn on her arm. She's probably too much of a wimp to go to a pool, cause then everybody'd be able to see it. Wait, is it really that gross? I want to see it. Come on, stop it, please. Wow, rude. Why is every kid a bitch in this game? What? <laughs> Oh, she's going to Go get him, Mitsuo. Yeah. 
めんねどどうしたの<笑>
and is actually a serial murderer that clones himself as other people. <laughs> I think it makes perfect sense. <laughs> All right, we're taking a few swings. Oh, wait, no! Oh, no, another game I could be bad at. Fuck. Okay, reverse left stick control. Swing, we just gotta swing. The doggo. Oh. <laughs> Those kids are way too close. Y'all need to like spread out far. Like you, you need to stand far. Holy sh! Oh. <laughs> I feel bad Oof. looking at every kid that just face plants into the ground. Oh my god. Why am I laughing at that? It's just so funny. It's funny. Why am I laughing? I'm an asshole, that's why. Uh. Uh. What's right here? Seriously, you don't know? Oh, God. Right field's over there, pretty far from the batter. Just stand back there and get the ball if it comes your way. Right field is where you always put your worst player. Oh. I'm ready! Just kidding. Kids falling is always funny. No, it's not! They get hurt, and it's not funny! Ugh. I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Akira Kun, he. Oh, God. Baseball, what in the world were you thinking? Do you hear me, young man? My Akira-chan is a fragile boy. He can't be playing sports with you ruffians. Uh, Akira-kun tripped and he and hit his head when he was running after a fly ball. Oh. Does my Akira-chan look like the kind of boy who runs? How dare you? Ev everybody runs. What do you mean? What? What kind of a comment is that? <laughs> Baseball is 
absurdly dangerous. I can't believe you would let your children play un unsupervised. How dangerous can it be with a rubber ball and a plastic bat? Besides, it's totally normal for kids their age to be playing sports on their own. It's okay, Uncle Kaz. This was all my fault. I made it. I made a Kirakun do it. Oh no! It's him. What are you teaching these children? The school board is gonna have to hear about this. I can promise you that. Why is it you? Why is it that you always seem to be at the center of my problems, Kiryu-san? Mm -hmm. Wait, you know this brute Hashimoto Sensei? Yeah. Not exactly. He runs his orphanage, though. Those foul-tempered orphans of of his caused quite the trouble for my son recently. <gasps> then is it possible they forced my poor sweet Akira-chan to play that horrible game with them? I simply cannot stand for this. Well, what do you have to say for yourself, young man? This silly game was just an excuse to bully my innocent boy, was it? Koji's no bully. How am I supposed to believe that after what happened to my Akira-chan? Police! I want the police here! Okay, what? Koji-kun, I'm so sorry. You guys let me play with you, then I had to go and mess it all up. It was fun, though, baseball. Maybe we can play again sometime, once I get better. Of course. Oh. Baseball Akira-chan, what are you saying? You must have hit your head even harder than you realized. And don't get any ideas about seeing those awful orphans again. I'm forbidding you from ever coming back here. That's not awful, Mom, and they didn't pressure me into anything I wanted to. Koji-kun and Taichi-kun are really nice, way nicer than the other kids in my class, so don't be mean to them. No, Mom, everyone here gets along so well. Nobody ever bullied me, not like at school. <laughs> You're being bullied at school? Sometimes. ジョキュセンの橋本くん。まさか。ちょっと。あなた話があるわよ。今の一体どういうこと? So, Akira here is actually the same Akira from Persona 5. This is a baby Akira. And it makes perfect sense because his parents are also assholes, right? Bye bye. Totally canon! She didn't mean what she said, Koji. Don't let it get to you, okay? Oh. I won't, especially because I made a new friend out of it. That's a good way to look at it. Isn't your flight soon, Uncle Cass? Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Just let me know when you're gonna leave, okay? I'll let the others get the others to say goodbye. Are you leaving now? Yep. Yes, Akira knows Kiryu. Or knew him. <gasps> we changed into my suit! Oh, that's incredible. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, no. <laughs> you look cute. Oh, that's so sweet. Why are you looking at me like that? だからしばらくの間うちで預かることにした。どうだお前たち。仲良くできるか。当たり前じゃ。That's right, Taichi. よろしくね、さきちゃん。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろしくね。よろし
I don't want to leave the kids behind. I don't want to go to Camarocho. Public market downtown. They have a lot of stuff there. It's all super cheap. Oh. Okay. Oh god. What is this fan service? Oh god. Wait, it's her! Oh my god, no! It's these two bitches! <laughs> There's no escaping those two, huh? But the real question is what the heck are they doing in front of our house? Oh my god. Why are they still together is the better question. This guy is a grade A asshole. <sighs> you're that guy from Kamarocho. I remember you. Do you recognize us? How could I not? I see you're still together somehow. Of course we are. Don't tell me you want to get between me and my amazing Mizuki-chan. Sorry, but this angel is mine. Actually, I just want to make sure you're not going to try to kill yourself again. I have enough to deal with without you lovebirds getting into trouble in front of my orphanage. Me? Kill myself? Why would I do that? Mizuki-chan and I have always had a wonderfully close relationship. Right, Mizuki-chan? Oh, Akimoto-kun, you're gonna make me blush. Where'd you get the money to go on vacation in Okinawa, anyway? It's part of the loan I took out for our wedding. Though we haven't officially tied the knot yet, we're just engaged. Okay. Akimoto-kun is my fiancé now. Ah, huh? good for you, I guess. You'll still need to leave, though. I hate to break it to you, but this beach isn't open to the public. Not to mention the fact that it's not even beach season. Go frolic somewhere else. What gives? It's not like this beach belongs to you or anything. This frolicking is gonna make us make a great story to tell our kids one day. That's right, we've made so many wonderful memories, right? We sure have. I'm getting kind of hungry. Okay, then let's go to the public market to eat. Oh, God. I think there's a ghost in my phone. It just lit up all by itself. And not only that, it lit up all by itself and then opened Twitter. By itself. My phone is... There's a ghost in my phone. She got the nav. Oh no. The nav installed itself into my phone. Dude, that'd be so fucking creepy. Oh my god. If a random app appeared on my phone, I would lose my goddamn mind. I don't know how the P5 characters aren't, like, super perplexed by that. Like, that alone would just freak me the fuck out. I'd be done. I would- I would throw my phone away. Don't hit me! I would be like, fuck a virus. Can you even get viruses on phones? Is that- that's a dumb question. You can get viruses on anything. I've just never heard of a phone virus before. You can? Oh my god. How? You go on fishy websites on your phone. I can't carry anymore. Ew! Eerie stuffed toy. What is this? It's cursed. What the fuck? Oh. 
Oh god. Ugh. Okay. Um. Uh, I want to do some more plot, but literally- Oh god, my stomach is caving right now. I don't know why I'm so hungry. I'm normally not this hungry. Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, ah, uh, fuck, okay. My stomach is like, please stop stream, you're starving, by the way. Gosh, my stomach is being so melodramatic. Yeah, the, the doll cursed me with hunger. Oh my god, no! That's so crazy. Stop! Don't say that! You guys are making it even more cursed. Alright, I'll get off. I was gonna keep streaming, actually, but my stomach says no.